Yo, what's up guys? Chase the Barrow here. Welcome back to another Elden Ring invasion stream. Hello everybody, hello. How goes it? Welcome back, JD. How are you, man? Talik, Salter, how goes it, man? Classic Andy, hello. What is up, everyone? Hang on a second here. Let me just whoop, pause that. Yes, today we are a wizard. I did say I wanted to try out all the stat procs, so I, I was looking into Frostbite, and most things that are Frostbite are intelligence scaling, so I was like, alright, well there's a lot of ice magic as well that I found. I may as well make an intelligence based frost mage, I guess is the best thing to call it. What is up, what is up? Uh, I have a few weapons here as well, there's the stats on the right if you guys do want to check it out. Uh, 36 intelligence because one of the spells that I'm using needs 36 intelligence and then I have a few weapons I have a cold Uchi Gatana. Uh, I have the moon veil in precarious situations <laughs> uh, We have the cold rapier and I don't know how I feel about the carrion knight sword, but we'll try it out It's it's a straight sword. They're never my favorite, but we do have it and then I have two staffs uh, Because I plan to jump up maybe 10 levels halfway through the stream to try out some other things in other areas But I did want to invade the school because I'm a wizard, you know how could I not invade the wizard school as a wizard? And also the carrion manor as well. Which is up here, yes. <laughs> no moon veil. Oh, we have it, but I'm not going to be using it all the time unless I'm facing some uh, pretty rough stuff. Uh, Moonlight Greatsword, it's... I guess it's pure int, but I wanted ice magic, and it's not really... I guess it's kind of ice. I didn't even think about that, to be honest. Um, but I do have a Ajula's Moonblade, so we're going to try that out. Let's do like a first invasion here. See how it goes. I'm a wizard. I am. And yes, I like this chest piece. Sue me. I like the fluffiness of it. It, it suits well with my hat, alright? Don't diss, don't diss the fashion. This is a battle wizard. It's chilly when it's cold. Uh, the buff for Dark Moon Greatsword is completely ice. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. I was looking at it, but it's int damage, right? So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, one of your playthroughs, Ronnie won't appear. I've never had that happen. Um, Ronnie's always in her tower. Is it actually, George? I didn't even look at that. Are you serious? <laughs> no way. That's amazing. I'm a healthy wizard. Oh yeah, we don't we don't make squishy wizards. Well, we're we're squishy. We're still squishy. Don't get it wrong. We don't have much absorption, but we are a wizard. All right, where's my compass? They are nearby. I'm blind. There he is. Hello, stars. How are you, man? Wizard. And then we have the ice stomp. Wait, we do our ice stomp into our ice magic, I guess. What does this do? Ah, okay. That's kind of cool, though. Coward, come back here. I have my homing soul mass. With Adjula's main. Get in here with that axe. I'm a filthy wizard. <laughs> oh, a spin blade. Okay. Hey, Chase, how are you? By I'm the way, pretty I good, Ken. How are you, man? Honesty, Hope your day is going easy. well. I'm trying Vagabond, like you suggested, but as I knew, I have no clue where to go to first. Vagabond is pretty cool. I can't even deny I've been enjoying my, uh, my Vagabond starting class. Oh, a blue with an ultra. Woo. All right, we got to take out the blue with Adjul's Moon, I guess. We'll try with Adjul's Moonblade and see how it goes. Oh, that scream. I didn't even see it coming. I don't know if you guys did. <laughs> Hey, another invader! Wow, this is a poppin' world, dude! This is cool! Oh my god, it's another wizard! <laughs> a little crabby. Bap! Oh my god, this thing. <laughs> It grabbed the invader. No, invader, you fool. Oh, the blue's still alive. Oh, shit. I gotta watch out for this. Oh, yeah. That honestly killed both the host and my teammate. <laughs> That's really funny, though. Gah, gah. 
Yo, I have I have three FP flasks, okay? I'll make it work. <laughs> oh, proficient. I'm more of an upfront wizard. I have I have FP, okay? <laughs> just there's not a lot of it. That's all. I just gotta drink my FP juice. <laughs> That's why I said I'll be leveling it up. I think I'm gonna want more FP, bro. <laughs> You're a wizard, where's your FP? FP barely grows when you level it, man. I thought it'd be more worthwhile to have three flasks. <laughs> Yo, Ken, thank you, man. Hope your day's going well. Those enemies are the new Herald. Yeah, they, they almost took us all out, to be honest. <laughs> I'm a wizard. I'm loving Elden Ring, honestly, man. Oh, no! <laughs> Get out of here! Leave Harry alone. At least I'm not part. Exactly. You know, I figured. Uh, maybe we'll make a squishy mage eventually. It's been working though. I tried it out last night. We did well with it. Hey, it's it's the the moon. You have the power of the moon sky, but I I don't need it right now because you're just throwing those out willy nilly. I will dodge the moon. I will get you with something far scarier though. Don't you worry. Let me plan my filthy wizard ambush, and then we'll be good. Oh my god, did he roll off the cliff? My filthy wizard ambush is ruined. <laughs> what the hell were you doing? Nothing was even near him. My man was moon veiled up and ready. What happened? Why? <laughs> Why did that happen? What the hell? <laughs> okay, let's go more in the corridor. I think it's more fun near the Church of Cuckoo. <laughs> My god. <laughs> what the hell? He was lacking the int. <laughs> That's kind of true. Oh, uh, I'm really not sure on what levels are going to be the PvP levels, uh, Kecko. I mean, the game came out two weeks ago, and so much of the player base isn't even done the game yet. So, it's kind of early for me to say that. Lots of people are saying, like, 130 to 150 as, like, an average. So, I, I, I think that could work as well. I mean, people went all the way up to 139 in Dark Souls 3. I could see it being fine. Um... It's gonna be around. Yeah, that's 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 close to my guess. Like anywhere from there. Like the regular 125 to 150 will probably be the end result of it. But uh, we don't know yet. We need ice puns after every kill. <laughs> also, I was trying to figure out like weapon level matchmaking. Um, so I think a plus four somber equals plus ten, right? I'm fairly certain. Uh, because they're like 2.5 of each other. I don't really know. But that that's that was my best guess. Hey, what's up, man? How goes your day? Harry Potter puns after every kill? Yeah, plus four is plus ten. Okay. That's what I thought. This this staff doesn't level up, and this staff was a normal staff. Academy Glintstone, so I think uh, the one that I currently have is better though, sorcery scaling, sadly. Um I know you can uh you can use like 13 I don't know I found like 12 respec items in my one playthrough so uh maybe we'll move outside not a lot of people in here at the moment I guess let's go try the academy gate town um the dragon spells honestly seem pretty strong I think I'm gonna try that eventually not entirely sure yet though now let me make sure this is this is academy Glen. yeah I don't even know what like some of the better spell staffs are. Oops, I almost watched a video. Yeah. It seems okay. There we go. Try out the whirly gig saw. That's a quality weapon, right? I need to also do quality. So I've done bleed, madness, uh I guess int now. This is my int build, so <laughs> We're going to see how this goes. Mm. 
what is the sound with the soundtrack DLC that costs extra? It's like, I I'm not sure, Ken. I'm not a huge magic guy. Oh, I mean, music guy. <laughs> I'm also not a huge magic guy, but it's okay. There we go. All right, we're going to get out of the blender of the, the poison. We're going to definitely try and just hit him with the ice. It's a naked wizard. That is not what you want to be. Dodging your throwables. You dare throw stuff at me. Oh, that actually stunned my magic. Wow. Oh, that was a bad decision, man. That thing hits really hard if you hit the sword and the... I'm almost bled build up, so I'll dodge the next one. Cat one! Come back here. Face my ice magic. Uh, okay, we're gonna have to use our FP before we reload our... our FP bar here to be more efficient. Ooh. 40 damage. Interesting. Whee! Now we drink FP. There we go. Now we can try a few of the other spells. Can we free aim this? Will it track? I don't think so. Let's try this. Right into my ice. Perfect. Battle wizard go brr. Oh yeah. Perfect. Honestly, yeah, any light weapon I can take one trade with with the boys that I aim for, so I'm able to bait them in to try to attack me during that, and then I just can almost one-shot them with it. Does a lot of damage with the sword and blade. Harry Potter. <laughs> Thank you, Ken, though. Um, I know it does come with music. I know that's a thing. Need some fire bombs to reset the frost. Oh, that could be a good idea. I was actually thinking of having like a fire sword or something. But this is just so aesthetically pleasing to be all ice. That was cooler than holding soul mass. Yeah, there, I did have this on here. I'll try out some other spells for you guys as well. I have uh, a lot more in the grace site. I can like show you them and look through them. Oh, memorize spell. I still have an open slot actually. I just didn't want to cycle through so many spells. There weren't any more ice ones that I found. Except for frozen armament, but I mean... We already have ice weapons. I could add the bow. Loretta's great bow. Not exactly ice, I guess, but it looks cool. <laughs> there we go. Definitely looks cool. Yeah, the madness thing was actually uh, pretty crazy. The stat procs in this are very different than Dark Souls 3. Let's go to the school, maybe. I do like the... What's the best area to invade in the academy? Most battle, biggest zone, I guess. Is it this place? I'm trying to remember where I was. Two hits from the weapon art. Yeah, it gets crazy, uh, Proficient, the more you scale into it. I mean, in Endgame, when I was playing through it, I was, like, staggering bosses so quickly. Wait, this isn't even where I thought I was. Where's the other place? Is it here? Schoolhouse classroom? I think it's there. I haven't found a, a larval farm yet, uh, but I, I wonder, there could be, there could be a way to farm the larva. I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, yeah, true, true. You're right. Okay, yeah, that's better. That's what I thought. Out of all of these areas, um, we'll go to the Al Atlas Plateau. Oh my god, is it Atlas Plateau or Altus Plateau? I was also thinking of going to the Volcano Manor as well. I just wanted to invade here because it's like a wizard place, you know? Uh, yeah, I beat the game, well, not all the way on my PvP characters. They're basically at the end game. Uh, like, they can beat it whenever they want. I just don't need to, you know what I mean? I don't want to beat the last boss for no reason on my, like, level, like, 60s. They're not worth. Yeah, I'm going to jump up to 70 soon. Actually, let's try the school quick. Or the, the manor, the royal manor. Then soul level 1? I could try soul level 1, man. Oof. Soul level 1 playthrough on this. 50 was hard enough. I'm not even going to lie. Like, uh, well, you know what? The Golden Godwin wasn't too bad. You need him for the talisman slot, but killing the commander sucked. <laughs> I just used Ice Stomp. It helped so much.
Ooh, there we go. We're in the Carrion Royal. Wait, they're behind me? No, they haven't been here yet. Uh, What? They didn't even aggro the people behind me. Okay. Yeah, the magic in Elden Ring is a lot crazier than Dark Souls 3. Like, 100% crazier. <laughs> it's not even close. Oh, with Spirit Ashes. I haven't really tried those. Does summoning a Spirit Ash make, like, the boss have more HP, though? Like, does it count as, like, summoning an NPC? If it does, that would kind of be sucky. Oh, Gaia! No! No, Gaia! My wizard invasions! <laughs> Everyone's dying. <laughs> no. Okay. It doesn't. Okay, that might be helpful then. If you guys are trying to do a low-level run, then yeah, the ashes probably help a lot. I heard there's a there's definitely that mimic one, right? That basically is like a clone of you. That sounds like it would be powerful. That sounds like it'd be strong, actually. Mimic is very good, yeah. Oh, can you sublimate sublimed? I didn't even think of using Scarlet Rod. I just I stomped the phantoms and then learned his fighting really well enough to not get hit much. I think I could hit take one hit basically, or I'd die at the second one. Okay. Must be close by because the compass isn't here. Wait. Uh, you know what they got to work on, though, in Elden Ring? The spawn points. They need more of them. I constantly spawn so far from who I'm invading. So we're going to use the warp item and hope we get closer. And it's always... I don't think they accounted vertical into the spawning. Because I... <laughs> what? What? Did that not... Is that, was that not supposed to warp me? Why am I... What? What happened? <laughs> what happened? Oh, did I get fog walled during that? What the hell? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, you just have to run through the game, Hitman Chief, because like you need your Estus and you need uh, the key items like your talisman pouch and stuff, so there's no way to get around that. You have to just beat it at a low level if you want to PvP at a certain level. Well, not a low level, but like even mid-game, you know? Okay. Oh, hello! Hang on. This looks like a perfect spot for the mist. Okay, maybe that mist is a little underpowered. Can we just, uh... <laughs> take that into consideration for a second? Ooh, that goes through the shield. Hey, look. Oh, I need more FP. Not for this, though. He likes his jelly shield. We'll just bleed him. Or we'll frostbite him, maybe? Oh, he's dead. <laughs> okay, I need more FP. Nice, <laughs> we almost killed the mage in the back. That would have been perfect, actually. We did kill the mage in the back. That was perfect, actually. <laughs> no, <laughs> you stupid giant. I only get three of those shots per flask. I gotta make it count, man. I gotta make it count. Get your butt back here, hosty. Ow. Filthy giant. Come back here, order 66. Whee. Yes, I'm a very under FP'd wizard, but you know what? We're making it work. Damn right we are. Damn right we're making it work. We got ice. We got these to ice blast combo and heavy. And then we have uh, we have two more flasks. We're fine. We're, we're chilling. We'll get in there with our sword for a second to get them. Like maybe half health, I would say. Half health might do the trick. We have our regen going too. We'll hit him with the ice here. And he put out. Hmm. <laughs> what? So sad. That was a fun one. My poor wizard. Uh, I use a PS4 controller, personally. Oh, what are my stats? There you go. They're on the right right there. Oh, well, they were on the right. 
Yeah, we rocking the hat again, man. We never taking the hat off. Well, we are, but not when we don't need poise. Hello. Hello. Hello, boys. All right, he's got the moon veil, probably. Yes. Of course he does. I have one of those, too, but we're not going to resort to that yet. Moon veil that. We frostbit the host. Take that right. Ragnar Lothbrook. I have parkour that I can do. We can bait them here. That's hitting the host. Maybe not. Dodge that. Maybe he'll try and come into my Agila's Moonblade. Honestly, I think I can fire my my weapon art a couple times. He has the blood one. Got Moonveil. It's a little bit on the laggy side, but uh, I couldn't stun. I couldn't tank that one for some reason. Will this reach that? Almost. Okay. What? Samurai Jack, fear my, fear my attack. All right, that was all of our We're gonna be more conservative now. They're a little bit, they're a little bit on the defensive side. He's not gonna like what I just did. You like Moon Veil used against you. I have it too. Not that I'm going to use it though. Very often. I see you, Samurai Jack. Ragnar lost right. That might kill him. Ah, uh, I didn't. That did combo though, whatever he just did. That was interesting. Oh, he's got he's got heals. Hmm, with the blood loss, that's pretty strong. Oh, I think the blood loss actually stuns. We gotta remember that. Come here, Ragnar Lothbrook. Oh shit, that, whatever that was, that hurt. Goodbye, Ragnar Lothbrook. I got hit by the giant right there, I think. <laughs> Ooh, Yo, Josiah, thank you so much, man. I'll read that in one second. Hey, bloody dude. Okay, the giant's still hitting me. That hurts my soul. I'll we'll probably try to get him to trade um, into my Moonblade. He's pretty aggressive. Yep. Best girl's hat. Granny is best girl, and no one can change my Goodbye, mind. Samurai it's a Jack. Shame the like Jesus is worse than the moon veil <laughs> ah, fun I fight, man. managed to do that, but they did. Also, donating to make up for the last one that didn't go through. Aw, oh, Josiah, thank you so much. Let me read that for a second. Uh, Ronnie is the best girl, and no one can change my mind. It's a shame the Moonlight Greatsword is worse than the Moon Veil. Yeah, the Moonlight Greatsword's like buff is cool, but then you have to try like heavy attack to get the ice blades. Mm, and it's slower. It's true. And it's heavier. And it's more for uh, a pure int. I guess the Moon Veil is Dex int, right? So. Thank you so much, though. Uh, Horfrost is a good uh, ice attack. It is. I wish there was like an ice blade kind of you could use, but there's like a. A nice aura. It's not as strong. I had it on my rapier to try it out. Uh, at, well, I mean, I can't tell you where they all are. You can use wiki. That would help you. Uh, Agilus Moonblade that you get through Ronnie's quest line. So that one's the most time consuming to get. And, and the hat that I'm wearing, so. I uh, know I just respec with the, with the larva tier. Larval tier? Larval tier. Yeah, I forget what it's called. I am a wizard, boys. I am a wizard. Indeed. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, not the that, not the quality build one. There is like an ice rapier. I know that, but it scales off quality and my build is pure int, so... What? Oh, they're up top. See what I mean? But the weird spawn points? Uh, yeah, I well, we're all saying like 120 to 150 is going to be meta, but uh, like a lot of people aren't there yet, so you'll definitely get more invasions in like the 60 to maybe 100 range at this point. I've been doing 60 and 70 and testing them all out. I get constant invasions at this soul level, so I just spent a couple days here. 
150 but still can't invade anywhere yeah i mean not a lot of people are there you guys got to give it time <laughs> like all of us that are playing the game a lot like not everyone's doing that right not everyone's sinking like eight hours a day or more into the game you gotta you gotta give them a little bit of time to catch up <laughs> didn't spawn me either damn i gotta just go up and around i guess Ah, uh, yeah, Hanbra. I mean, there's no illegitimate way to make a character in Elden Ring. You just run the game at level whatever you want. I know it seems weird when people get into Souls and, like, they're like, oh, how the hell did this guy beat the game at level 50? But, like, it's not that hard once... Well, it's, it's hard. I'm not going to say it's not hard. It is hard. Some of the bosses in this game are hard as hell. The ones that you get the talismans from and stuff, they take a while to beat at this level, but it's do it's doable. It just takes time. Um, I did. I didn't kill the final boss, though, because I don't need to. What? How are they? This compass, man. This compass. L listen, I have three FP flasks. <laughs> it's been working. Don't knock it, man. Don't knock it. It's been working. Never seen a wizard with so much HP and so little FP. I've been doing well with it. I'm not going to lie. We've been hitting some good hard shots. You just got to make it count, you know? You just can't be spamming the magic. Hey, boys. Welcome to hell. <laughs> Don't bump. That hurts. That, that's, see, that's, that's wizard pain right there. Hey, you have a wizard sword as well. Ha! Ice beats ice. I don't even know what else to say there. Hey, he's chilling in the corner. Dodge. Alright, so we can make an ice storm happen, but that's about it. And then we're going to have to refuel. Our wizard juice is low. Hey, boys. What does that even do? Why is he spamming it? I don't, I don't understand. What does that do? It's weird. Get your ass had by a sword. <laughs> what does that do? <gasps> I don't understand. He's like spamming it, and I'm so confused. Invulnerability? Is that what it is? I thought it was charging up some ridiculous thing that I didn't know about. Iframes? <laughs> Maybe? <laughs> Possibly? <laughs> Dodge! That's such a weird fucking thing. I gotta learn what that is later. Potato summoned. That went right through me. Oh my god, there's a blue there. What in the hell? Random blue summoned right behind me. Alright. Noted. Good thing we have Estus. Follow me, Mr. Blue. I'll take care of you first. Nice. That was a 2 4. I'm out of FP. There goes the blue. This guy in his weird attack that I don't know what it does. I think he might die to this. Oh, it is invulnerability. Oh. Oh, that's an interesting attack. So for like a little bit, he's invulnerable to anything. That's pretty strong. That's why he was spamming it so much. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, I can throw on some non-frost spells. I guess. We can, we can, just to mix it up. Some of these have been sucking, actually. We may as well swap some out, now that you say that. Like, um... Not a fan of Glintstone Iceberg. I don't think we've hit that, and this sucks. Do not... Do not use the Freezing Mist. Um, what, what can we sub it for, though? I don't know, Loretta's Bow, maybe? Or maybe the big Great Phalanx? The bow is kind of easy to dodge in hindsight, but... What about this hammer? 
That'd be cool. Nazar's Comet. I mean, that's easy to dodge too, though. It's just like a beam. Um, try Cannon of Haima. Okay. Throw on Cannon of Haima. Um... Great bow is decent. You're, you know, you're right. We'll get that, and then we'll have well, maybe the Great Phalanx one. Maybe those do larger damage. We'll try that as well. Too bad the Ice Storm isn't the best, but I kind of like it. Maybe, maybe we can proc Frostbite with it. I don't know. It's kind of a waste of FP in a way. Yeah, the bow is good for range. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Maybe we'll have one quick uh, finish. Like, maybe what we'll do is we'll put the sword second or we'll have maybe like a glintstone shard maybe which one's fast but kind of decent damage swift glintstone maybe ambush shard is pretty fast just like as a finish okay we'll try ambush shard too okay let's try this we'll try all of them basically why not right <laughs> we're a wizard may as well give it some love Gravity well is okay for stopping runners. Ooh, so there's so much magic. I'm, I haven't been a wizard at all yet, so. This is like a complete learning experience. Wee. Okay, compass, compass. Good to see Wizard utilize past pebble, pebble, pebble. Yeah, I've never been a fan of the chip damage wizard. I don't know. This is very boring to play. <laughs> I, I find this type of battle better. I have a decent sword. Uh, my, my weapon art is ice, so it goes well with the ice magic. And all the other spells we can just try out for fun now. Oh, yeah, that's the orb that pulls them towards you. That's kind of cool, actually. Maybe I'll try that. Favorite build so far? I'm not really not sure. They've all been, like, fun in their own way. I haven't tried, like, all the different types of builds yet, so it's, it's hard. Um, the bleed builds... I think the bleed builds can have a lot to them. I used a very not the best sword. It, its scaling was broken, so we can revisit that. Maybe we do wield some stuff. That could be cool. Oh, they're back that way. Don't I want more FP? Well, <laughs> this has actually been working. I don't think I've run out of FP once. I wanted more damage. Oh, they're up there. Oh. Oh, beam. Oh, wait. Can I even... Bro, that is a mission. Do you know where I have to go to get there? I do, and it's so far. Oh, that's like out of the castle. Actually, straight up, that's like... Maybe the hunter will be summoned near me. To get there, I have to go around the castle. This is madness. This. Oh, he came this way. Hey, let's go. Thank you for hopping down. I appreciate you. Hey, boys. It's really easy to dodge, though, when I know it's coming. Otokoda. That could be the... Oh, no. He just has the beam. Hey, there. Bad trade. I hear somebody up there. Ooh. Those somehow are missing me. Haha. <laughs> Oh, I see. He made like a wizard battle gun from above. I wonder how this works. Pretty good. His range isn't the best, though. I have an idea. <laughs> that looked fucking cool. <laughs> No damage. That's weird. Hmm. See, there's sometimes where like they'll get hit by things in this game though, where they just don't take damage at all. I've noticed that a decent amount. That time we hit him, but still, there's been moments. 
<laughs> Bo. Okay, we're gonna get out of the, the caster's room just because he's just going, dude. He's just going with that. Oh, he's got the no HP sight. I see. This is weird. Are we really camp in the corner? Really? <laughs> we're really camp in the corner. <laughs> really miss the blue. That was a whatever he hit me with. A really heavy shot. <laughs> oh, he's got the bow. <laughs> oh, that's kind of funny. Okay, we'll do a little bit of regening here. <laughs> Just as to not waste Estus. I kind of want him to fire that. <laughs> My man and his bow. Okay. There you go, Scythe guy. Get involved. There's two of you. You got the numbers. You're fine. Okay. I got one last flask. We're going to have to take care of somebody with this amount of FP. Going to have to be very careful. Are you guys really retreating all the way back? Oh my god. I thought I'd have the poise needed. I'm just going to tank it and... Whoa. Nice. <laughs> Shit. We're back in wizard domain. Oh, good thing we dodged the shit out of that. <laughs> See, this is the war. How much FP do you think that wizard has? Jeez, it's been going. <laughs> ah, that might get him. We're low on the FP. For once the... Oh. Yeah, get out here, boys. Don't worry. Don't worry. You don't need your infinite wizard up there. He's, he's strong, but he's not... Why do you... Why you... Come on. Use your swords. There's two of you. You got this. You got this. Help him out, Sunbro. Help him out. Nice, Sunbro. Dead. That gives me the FP that I need. All right. Perfect. Now, is there a ladder? Or do I really, really need to go all the way around? I'll do it. I'll do it just to murder you. I know where that is. Let me just think. Let me think the fastest way there. I have to literally go... Oh wait, I can't, I can't, can I get there? I would have to go around to Ronnie's rise. Okay, I'll do it. Just to, sm just, just to spite this guy. Or use the finger, yeah, we'll try the finger once. If it doesn't work, we'll go around. Good morning, Fighterian. how goes it? I guess I could try the cannon to snipe him. Hey, Chase, give me tips too. Eating millennia casual, I've been stuck here for like five hours. How did that not hit him? Oh, he's in the middle by the bonfire. Oh my god, he summoned another one. Okay, well, we gotta kill another guy, I guess, to get more FP again. Is this their way of... Is this early Elden Ring gank? You stand somewhere that <laughs> the invader can't get to and then you just do that? Okay. <laughs> I mean, I'll go around. Like, at this point, I'm just going around. Hell yeah, what a fighter. How goes your day, man? I'm going around. Screw it. They don't expect me to know how to get there, but I do. I do know how to get there. Just gotta get down. I tried the bloody finger. It just warped me back to the room that he's in. Okay. 
Wait, which way is out of the castle? This way. They really are. Like, the, the finger teleports don't take into consideration the, the vertical height, it seems. So, like, there's areas where you just can't get to unless you go to another part of the area. This is fog walled where we, we can't get to them. Okay, no, we can actually go around. Huge. At least I think we can go around. Oh, wait, maybe we can't. There's a giant wall here. Thank you. Named my inchar dishonest wizard in honor of you. Nice, Kyle. That's awesome, man. Or maybe we can. No, maybe we can't. Without the horse, I don't know if we can get there. Yeah, I have to go through here, but I don't think we can get there. Right? Is there any way for me to get like here? I guess I can progress and then go through there maybe? I You have to go through Loretta's room, right? Yeah, I mean, I don't know if we can go through Loretta's room. <laughs> yeah, we might have to just leave this. I'm just gonna have to think. There's no way to like hop up here without a horse. Loretta's room leads you around here and you can't get up here. Wow. Wow. You, you have to, but how are they up there? They are up there, right? Maybe I can run through the boss room if they've beaten the boss. Yeah, let's go check. Cause like, if the boss room's there, though we're boned. We have to we have to leave. Yeah. That is the only way. Best mage I've seen this day is I'm not an owl. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna go around. I'm so used to Dark Souls, I didn't know you can, uh, you can go through the boss rooms. Yeah, they couldn't have got up there without killing it, right? So I should be able to run through it. Need FP regen. Is there even an FP regen uh, talisman? I haven't seen one. Oh, he's still up there. Lol. Okay, I'm going around. <laughs> See you son, bro. Useless to fight you. You're just gonna resummon. <laughs> we're going, we're going. Oh wait, the boss room is that way. Oh, FP on each kill. Ah. Okay, we're going. All this for the kill of him, but you know, it, it's needed. Like, we need, we must, we must end him because he's gonna torment other invaders. Swap my ring back. Oh, yeah, I'm full health. <laughs> uh, let's do the FP one so we can use the storm stomp on him. Okay. Yeah, I, I know how to get there. And then you drop down near Celevis's tower. I know where it is. I just really didn't think I was ever able to run through a boss room. A commitment. <laughs> well, I just want to see if it's possible. Otherwise, there's some areas where people can literally camp that you could never get to because of like fog walls, but we'll see. Uh, no, I haven't done any summoning. Yep, look, see? Can't do it. Physically can't get to him. Oh, unless I can go this way. <gasps> Hold up. Wait. No, this doesn't lead to where they are. I need to be over there. 
Yeah, the, he's literally in a spot that no invader can actually get to. Through the boss. Yeah, but you can't go through the boss. See what I mean? I figured, because in all Souls games, like, boss areas are areas you can't uh, get through boss rooms. We must leave. Well, that's, in, that's unfortunate. That's a that's a pretty big oversight. <laughs> they need to fix that because they can just infinitely do that. You would never be able to get to the host. He just sits up there. Yeah, it's literally impossible to get to them unless there's. No, you you would you can't even jump this. I'm pretty sure with a horse. It's a really high mountain. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna keep patching things though. All right, where are we now? At least we have fight now. Up there. Oh, a wizard. Wait, I want to fight the host wizard. I mean the summon wizard first. Hello, wizard. Right into my ice. I like it. Will we frostbite him? How do we frostbite him already? Ow, lightning. It didn't stun me though. That's cool. Dodge the lightning. What do you got as a weapon? Moon veil? But it's out of FP, so it's a, it's a useless moon veil. Ah, uh, we got another fire on that eventually. I'm coming, G Genki. His name is Genki. Ah, <laughs> uh, you. Oh, we kind of frostbit him, sort of. That was weird. <laughs> that was kind of funny. We hit the phantom or the host while aiming for Sir Bonkums. All right, Sir Bonkums, use the weapon art. Do it. We're summoning another one, huh? Potatoes coming in. Too late. You dead, Sir Bonkums. Your timing on your Moonveil slice is not up to par. <laughs> hey, hey, get back here, Genki. I know it's not part of your lore, but come back. Yeah, that's right. I actually like this. I can pester people while they run away from me. Nice! That actually comboed. Wow. The stun hit right into the glintstone chart. Also, 115. That's not bad for a quick spell, actually. That's good. That's a good finisher. Wow, yeah, that's not that's not half bad. Let's go back to the the school though. We didn't get many there yet. Excuse me. Yeah, the arrows for runner exactly. And then when I had the madness build, the uh, the sniper madness incantation was perfect. It like instantly like traveled and hit them when they were trying to run away from me. Having some type of chase down is important for most builds, I would say. Uh, I haven't really tried daggers yet. This is my third day doing any type of PvP, so it's like I'm a wizard, I've done madness, which is kind of like faith, and then I've done my original bleed, which was, uh, it was okay. Oh, that's weird looking. That's good damage. <laughs> Honestly, half chunking someone with that sword, super cool. He realizes I'm ranged. Wait, oh, I don't have enough P to finish it off. Oh, I'll raid out of range with that. That's okay, though. We'll get our FP back. More of a fight is fun, anyway. Let's try this. He probably doesn't know what this does. Oh, I thought I could aim it better than that. That doesn't combo, but that's like the follower saber, honestly. It's pretty cool. Can do the stomp. Get some more FP back. Oh, that still hit him. Weird that that missed. 
Let's get this going and let's try the bow. Ah, oh, unfortunate. The bow's a little slow. The range on that's pretty good too. No. No heals. <laughs> ah, that missed. And they just keep ro oh frostbite on the roll spam nice. <laughs> I actually like the stomp for the chase down. I'm out of FP, but like it, it forces them to either roll towards me and aggress, or they have to like roll away to the left and right. Yeah, the bow's a little slow, so we're gonna we're gonna not do that at close to mid range. <laughs> but it's good to know. Hey Josiah, the worst part about the spell. You just use is that it's actually better than the real sword. For some reason, the spell can go up and down, but the sword blast only goes straight. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. Yeah, it kind of has like a, a diagonal hitbox, which is pretty good. Oh, no, I'm kind of having fun with the magic, honestly. It's different. I never use wizards in Souls games. Well, barely, anyway. The worst Y'all. Feels wizard hitting me. For some reason, the spell can go up and down, but the sword blast only goes straight. From soft PLS fix. Ronnie gear, yeah, for sure, Reverend. We did Ronnie's quest line. That's how I have the uh, Agila's Moonblade spell. Yeah, the the arrow was cool for like long range. So far, I've enjoyed that. Um, let's go to the main part of the school, the debate parlor. I, so far, fashion-wise, I do enjoy the veteran's chest piece, yes. I feel like it works with most things that I make. I like the cape. It's so flowy. I know the Uchi's a regular stone upgrade weapon. I've been tainted by magic just for today. <laughs> we'll be back to melee base uh, next stream. I also, the dragon stuff's a little OP, but we gotta try it, <laughs> you know? <laughs> gotta try out the dragon stuff eventually. Hey, we got a wizard with another wizard? So multiple wizards. Okay, he's a blood wizard, all right. So we got one blood wizard, one regular wizard. The range on that's pretty unholy. Whoever suggested mimic ear from William Iowa that can you got. Yeah, you like it. You, you like it. I have it back. I have it back. There you go. That's for you. <laughs> you want to be playing this game? <laughs> I've got some of those right there waiting for you. That was the best timing for my ice stomp I think I'll ever pull off. He got wrecked. Point blank arrow? I think so. <laughs> yeah, take that. Oh, take that. Yeah. You like the frosty wizard? The frosty wizard likes you. Haha. <laughs> That was perfect. Good work. Good work, teammate. What kind of godlike timing was that? <laughs> Imagine he's like, oh shit, I got hit by the stomp, and then a fucking giant blade just on his face. Oh man, that was funny. Man, Elden Ring PvP can be hilarious. Like, you just don't know what's gonna happen. It's so funny. We're gonna use that ball more, too. I don't know, I just I, having fun with it is just so good. That was so funny. Um, maybe. I guess maybe for DPS, the low, low cost might be good and win out. But, like, if you get someone to half health and they're playing aggressive, you can maybe finish them off with, like, Agila's Moonblade. Or Adela's. I've done that multiple times, so. I like my Moonblade. Whee! I want to be a Lizard Wizard. Or a Gizzard Lizard. Oh, are they in? Wait, can't I? Can I come here? Oh, I can! I didn't know. 
I thought this would be locked out. Wait, aren't they over there though? Hold up. I'm a trapped wizard. Trapped. <laughs> I guess I gotta jump over here. They're that way though. <laughs> How do I get that way? Okay, they need to they need to fix or are they below me? Oh they could be below. Oh, there's a blue. Hey, blue. Thank you for coming down, blue. So, yeah, they are up there. Okay, there's a lot of oversights in areas you cannot get to. Um, at least that's what I've seen. There's a lot of that. Yeah, these are kind of good. You guys aren't wrong. You guys are not wrong. Oh, he's also a wizard? Oh, that was unfortunate. That was a wizard mishap if I've ever seen one. Ooh, full catch. Okay, so this is some bro there. Where are you going? I'm trying to try and predict it. Oh my god, no way that happened twice! No way! <laughs> my man this is my best teammate. What the heck? That NPC though. <laughs> Timing of God. <laughs> it's like he waits for my frostbite to hit. It's so cool. <laughs> How does that happen two times in a row? What are the actual chances? Oh, I didn't want that to fire. Fear my wizard stick. It may be a tiny wooden stick, but it has power all the same. Oh, he's got a host coming. Okay. Ship him once. Get our regen going. All right, teammate, we got this. Me and you, Iron Maiden, me and you. Too bad backstabs don't exist on the first dust. Oh no, Iron Maiden, you're supposed to be my teammate, not work against me. No, oh, the door, get out of the door. No, be unfortunate. Well, you guys look like you've trapped yourselves, so let me just assert my dominance. Oh, it doesn't travel behind you. Oh, I see, I see, okay. Mistakes were made. Trade. Oh no, teammate! No! I didn't know there was a cliff there! No! Ah, oh, that could have been such a good one. Unfortunate. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Iron Maiden, you betrayed me! You betrayed me! <laughs> oh. The sadness. The sadness. I must remember there. Oh, yeah, it dips in here. I see. Unfortunate. <laughs> Unfortunate. <laughs> I think that was my first invasion death to that. That's really funny. It would be gravity that does me in. That's fair. It's my, it's my one weakness. Gravity. I'm coming, red. I'm just gonna avoid that side of the water fountain. Oh, wait, I'm confused. Like, like I just, oh, wait, oh. That cliff has claimed more souls than all things combined. <laughs> Honestly though, this thing is ridiculous. Its timing is hilarious. How? <laughs> Thank you, Josiah. Honestly, dude, so much support today. That's crazy, man. Thank you for everything. Okay, that cliff needs a nerf. Can we just agree? <laughs> yes, Dylan. I'm gonna I'm gonna pay cut that that uh what is that thing called? Iron Maiden. It was my teammate in the first couple invasions, but then it did me dirty right there. It did me dirty. Yeah, honestly, I love the ambient sounds in this game, by the way. That's like one of the best features. And the invasion music's pretty cool. Uh oh god, yes! Yes! They're in ball territory. Please don't leave. It's actually so fun fighting up there. No, come back. Come back. I swear it's fun. I promise. It's very fun. No, I'm not gonna stand where the ball's gonna land on my head. That sounds like a, what? A bad plan. 
You dare? This gives me time to cast my bow. Fear me. Get out that hole. Get out of it. Oh, I couldn't see because of the roof. No. Nice. All right, my bow's coming. Bad trade. Bad trade for you. I'll dodge that, though. That's a pretty strong spell when you think about it. What are you doing over there? You guys are closer to the hole than me. I think I can do it one more time. Yeah. That works. And then I can regen my FP. That is some unholy range you have there, sir. Hey, oh, I got a teammate. Let's go. Hey there. Oh, you dead. You dead. Oh, you dead too. Oh. <laughs> Magic sword powerful. All right, I'll accept my bonking now. Oh. <laughs> Good job, Carrion. <laughs> nice. Being a wizard is fun. I knew I'd sort of like the wizarding ways in this. John, hey Chase, any pro tips for a new PvP player? Uh, I just run away from it, <laughs> John. Like if you see someone setting up with that, you, you just gotta run away and there's no real counter to AOE death buildup. That's really, that's really it until they fix it, sadly. Thank you. Hi uh, Chase, any pro tips for a new PvP player oh, this is for the, the death earlier, kill slash shadow bug? Or the build that uses shield and blast you with some type of spell over and over. We did I kill the shield guy. A hey boys! Nice! You fool! You dare challenge the wizard sword? You're a sword of magic and something. Oh wow. Wow. I know they fear Agila's Moonblade. They would. <laughs> we did kill a guy using that shield thing though, John. You just gotta wait. Uh, and then it they'll they'll have to recast it. So yeah, there's that. Jabated, wow! How dare they, dude? How dare they? Um, yeah, they happen sometimes. Oh yeah, I have the veteran chest piece, but the other ones are called uh, Banished Knight Greaves. You get those by just farming, farming the knights, and then these are from the uh, Ronnie set. I don't think they uh, they patched the death thing, no, sadly. Uh, I think if they do it too much, they will, uh, Sele. Yeah, I, I don't know what that too much means, though. Thank you. That's really Will it. you be doing the Ashes of War showcase in the future along with special case weapons showcase like you did for Dark Souls 3? Uh, yeah, I've already kind of started. Like, this is this is the start of it. I just have to use them in invasions because there's no arena. Hello, Sam. Dung Fork. Wait, does that, say, does that actually say Dung Fork? I don't know. Yeah. Dodge you. Agilus Moonlight! Oh, you, you dare flee? All right, we have them both at bay. They're both a little on the scared side. He wants to come behind me. No one dare come behind me. That's for him. Whenever you think they're locked on to, whenever they think you're locked on to them, attack the other one. Oh wait, what? That is bad. I thought that was good. Wrong. You think my wizard powers are over? They've only just begun. Let's go with this. The old Dark Souls 3. I have. Oh, uh, you wasted them. You wasted my beautiful arrows. How dare you. You. You dare. There you go. I knew he'd start fire running right there. Which is good. Oh, I'm out of stomp. That's my last stomp. Okay. We used one of our flasks. This is fine, though. Got to get a little aggressive with the ice. Get the heal 
go in here. I wanted to actually lock onto the guy behind me right there, but it didn't work. They're playing the good old, uh, while he's looking at me, you attack him method. The age old 2v1 hey, strat. Love the PvP content. I personally love playing wizard builds. Can hey, you tell Fanta, me thank you, man. the other people who enjoy wizards? What is your build? Much love. There we go. Oh yeah, I'm gonna show the stats. No problem at all. No problem at all. Yeah, when people play super defensive, you're right. The melee pebble is definitely the way. That goes through shields. A little. Oh. That's interesting. This is going to be a long one because they're going to both play very defensive. So I can just let my regen go a little bit. Uh, I do have the Moon Veil as well to do some burst damage if I need to when they're unexpecting it. But yeah, I, I always show the stats like kind of near the beginning of the stream. We got a little bit of regen going here. Oh, you jumped my running attack, Sag. Moonveil is pretty powerful. We cannot deny that, that's for sure. I see you. Uh, oh yeah, I know you can. I don't plan to though. It does, it does enough work on its own. This is some higher latency as well. I can tell from the recovery. I can't like punish some of their attacks. Wish I could. Oh! I wish I could backstab. I say as I land a backstab. Need more FP. Oh, see that? That shouldn't hit me. Got that range. Yeah, moon feels pretty easy to dodge, in my opinion. I think uh, I kind of like the ice a little bit more. We're going to try and get the Iron Maiden involved to panic one of them. If I can be alone with one for like two seconds, we'll kill him. But the second we aggress either the shield guy or the other guy, um, they actually attack. It's like the only way they're fighting right now. They're not doing anything else. Everything I do against him is a trade also, even though it shouldn't be. Just because of our connection. Oh, I thought he'd get a little bit more in. Uh, yeah, we... Uh, no, the self-burning we've seen only with the shield. Not the curse one yet, so it's been okay. That guy's also super laggy. Yeah, he comes in every once in a while. Kind of, I kind of can appreciate him. The other guy's just kind of hanging back. He must be out of heals. Yeah, he, he literally runs around my camera view before he'll fight me. <laughs> it's really funny. Okay, now it's over. Oh, that wasn't enough to finish it, unfortunate. The bleed I gotta watch out for. Just start running in my face. <laughs> Okay. Goodbye, shield man.
Wait a second. No way, dude. Why does the chat do that sometimes, boys? My chat just died. Hang on. This has been an ongoing annoyance. You can probably still hear me, but I don't know. My ISP at a certain time of the day has been like full cutting it to uh, zero bit rate for like a minute or two. I guess that's when they reset the router or something. But anytime I reset my router, it's like completely fine. So I just need to remember to do that before I do any uh, of my streams, which is super just annoying. It's always perfectly fine after that. Ugh, <laughs> what a pain in the butt. We're back, we're back. At least the stream doesn't stop when that happens, but I usually have to like full, like unplug my router, plug it back in, wait for it. We're back, we're back. Pain in the booty. Hey, we back, we back. I just, I'm really going to make sure I do that every time before I stream. Sometimes I check it and it seems fine and then randomly that'll happen. So I'll just manually reset it before. It's the only way. I, have I entered the lava fall? Yeah, yeah, I've been inside of uh, the volcano manor. It's pretty awesome. Yo, Rin, thank you so much. Thank yes, you. tech difficulties are the most fun for sure. <laughs> I think it's fine now though. There we go. Uh, I could try some of the gravity magic. I was more going for the elemental, but I mean, yeah, we, we could, I guess. Thank you, Rin. I appreciate it. At least we got the end of that invasion. That would have been sad if it happened, like, during it. Alright, what do we got going on here? We're, what, by the way, this is such an interesting thing because you normally can't go in that area. It's a boss room. But I feel like I could jump down, maybe. I'm not going to, but I feel like we could. Oh, they're down there. Oh, they don't think I'm they don't know I'm up here, I don't think. Sneak. Sneaky wizard. Oh, I think they saw me. Hey. You open big, you know, that way they don't have a chance. Oh, it's the madness. Nice, mixed with the bleed. We gotta avoid the madness. It'll TP you back. Oh, an empty moon veil though. No, a sniper. Sniper, no sniping. Dodge. Aw, oh, I knew it was coming. This is wasting all his FP on. Oh, shit. I didn't think that could hit. Alright, we're good. Let's go. Oh, that wasted my FP. Yeah, that's the that's the good counter to me, just that's for sure. Woo! My teammate. Help me out, homie. Hook me up. Boris dead. No, 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 don't, don't kill me. I said hook me up. Hook me up. <laughs> don't kill me. <laughs> oh, nice. That was a clean one. Are you the host? So you can roll behind this and backstab it though. I didn't wanna I didn't wanna say that when I was using my madness build, because that would have exposed my weakness, but yeah. <laughs> Be careful when you use that weapon art on the madness build. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah, oh yeah, here's the build for you guys, by the way. My, my katana has frost and bleed build up. It's, it's a double whammy, although you probably won't get the bleed build up uh, unless you're spamming it, which, which would, you know, I guess it can happen from time to time, but. Ah, it's so fun, McThickens, honestly. You just gotta, you know, people take it too seriously sometimes, like things like Souls PvP. You just gotta enjoy it for what it is. There's lots of imbalances right now, you know, just, just gotta have fun with it. That's the best way I can put it. I do have Moonveil. I just I want to be more of like a frost oriented build at the moment, so we're just frosting it up a little bit. Oh uh, wait, I wanted to do the the tunnel area. There we go. This no spell wizard? What? 
Do you not see all these spells? <laughs> I think I've been. I actually, Adula's Moonblade has been getting me most of the kills. That and the Ice Stomp for sure. But like those two were the best together. Thank you. Uh, it's very different, hey Chase, Brian. How's very the different. PvP compared to DS3? Uh, but I'm enjoying it a lot. It's a lot more fun right now for sure. Ooh. I'm also trying to invade in areas that like kind of complement the build. Like I'm a wizard, so I'm in a wizard area. It's making it really fun. Okay. Where's my compass? Okay, so they have to be in that room. You know, it'd be nice to have an AOE like room attack. That would be good. Surprise! Oh, I wanted him to roll into that. He didn't. Honestly, I really want to try dual wielding katanas. They look really cool. They seem like they do well together as well. Nice. We hit. We hit Bast. Oh, he's got the blood slash. I did not expect that. Oh, the range kind of kind of throws me off sometimes. I think I'm safe, and then I still get hit. We're learning the ranges, though. There, that time we spaced it perfectly. Oh, yeah. Pebble. Pebble. It complements my wizard playstyle. Pebble. I'm out of FP. No pebble. <laughs> no pebble. You dare challenge a mage in his own domain? Yeah, get in your hole. Get in there. Get back in your hole. I have things I want to do. Give me cover, wizards. Yes, my gang versus yours. Hey, leave my wizard alone. Oh, I didn't even mean to hit the host. I was completely focused on uh, the guy on the left. Nice. <laughs> He didn't know what to do. He had to protect his hostie, but he had no health. Are right, we gotta tank one of those? Ooh, I'll tank that for this. Uh, oh, it's still, it has like a lingering hitbox. Oh yeah, the poise, the poise, man. That's why you want a little bit of armor as a wizard. You can tank light weapons and trade for your hardest hitting attack, which is the uh, Edgeless Moonblade. It's very good. A true ba wait, I almost said something else. A true what? A true master both dabble in the pebble. Exactly. Exactly. Um okay, let's go again. That's very low FP for a wizard. It's working, okay. I I want I want to hear nothing of it. Do I miss Nathan? What Nathan? My best bro Nathan? Always. <laughs> Hello. What up, Grazi? How goes your day, man? Do double Uchi. I kind of like the longer one, though. The Naki Nagakiba, I think. Nagakiba? I forget. Man, I think a lot of things damage need to be toned down in general. Uh, that's... And obviously some glaring, like, things that are unintended. But that's really all I can see so far. I'm interested to see what they do, like how they patch it and balance some of the strong things. I oh, know I've only done three builds. I've been a wizard, I've been uh, my madness build, and then I've tried bleed. They've all been pretty good. Oh yeah, we could try the spell hammer. Let's go. We could try that. Um, memorize spell. What have we not used the most? Honestly, the cannon. <laughs> Thank you. And this thing sucks. Could we get some spell hammer runs? I'm getting rid of that We'd thing. To see it it actually sucks PvP. more than anything. Let's try the hammer. Uh, the, the cannon could be useful. We could try a sneak attack with the cannon. That's like all I can think of right now. Okay. <laughs> Am I going to try poison? Yeah, I'm going to try all the stat procs. Uh, I don't know what one I want to do next, but I did say I wanted to do frost, and this is like the best way I think I could do frost. Okay, what do we got going on here? We got... Where is my compass? They must be around. They're lurking. Are they above me? The hammer is slow? Okay. I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> oh, 
Honestly, that hit really hard for what it is. Oh, God. I didn't even see us. Oh, I'm out of FP. I don't have enough. I don't have enough. No. It's okay. We can just storm stomp them to scare them a little bit. Hey, hey, hey. Frost bit him anyway. <laughs> the camera likes to fight me on, on the, the corners though. I've noticed that. That's definitely something. Any fun dex weapons? Well, I mean all of the dex weapons are pretty damn fun to me, to be honest. That's what you get for spamming R1 in the wizard's face. You gotta be less aggressive. You die in sync. You die together. Just as you fought. <laughs> Double kill. Kill kill. <laughs> that worked. Honestly, the hammer did better than I thought, though. And I just hit it with the AoE. I wonder how strong it'll be. If I hit the hammer, we gotta try that. We definitely have to try that. It's an ice wizard, Steven. Everything ice. My spells, except for the, the, the ones that people asked for. I started with all ice, but now we've kind of devolved <laughs> into regular wizard. Aw, oh, that was unfortunate. I do enjoy Agila's Moonblade, though. I think the coolest kills we've gotten are with this. The build is really cool. I, I do enjoy it. The ice, I'll, I'll just call it the Frost Wizard. <laughs> and the fashion's also cool. Thank you, thank you. I, I looked really hard for what kind of fashion I wanted. Really? Stop entering boss fights. <laughs> oh my god. Magic is so different. It really is. It really is. You could jump ground magic. Oh, that's interesting. I've never really... I haven't been using the jump too much uh, unless I want to attack with it. So, uh, I don't know. It's been interesting. I got to definitely grow that into my combat style. Oh, I guess I could use that. The physic tier that way. We got Peach. Hello, Peach. Oh, uh, Peach. Peach is a wizard. What kind of name is Peach for a wizard? Weird name for a wizard. Hey there. We gotta make him panic. We got the backline wizard. I can also fight the backline wizard. I don't know if he knows that. Will that reach? Damn, it's out of range. That means he's out of range for me though, so... That's kind of good. I got, I got one thing I can use. Kind of a bad trade, I guess. <laughs> Do that to cover myself for a second. I like the regen one. He likes jump attack, so we've learned that much. Alright, we may as well get a stomp here and then uh, maybe Ice Pebble if we can do it. Break his shield. There we go. And now we can get our FP back. Go get him, Alexander! That did a lot of damage. Oh, that can curve corners. All right. Did not know that. That guy hits for half my health. Nice. Nothing will stop me from getting my backstabs. Oh my god, that wizard's wizarding for its life right now. He knew if he dies, he's dead. His lifeline cut off right at the source. Bam. Oh. Okay, that was cool. That comes out quick. What are you talking about? Gavel of Hyma's fast. That is a fast hammer. <laughs> it's fast enough. <laughs> Smush the wizard. <laughs> that was so cool.
What the fuck? This game has so much, man. That's what I'm trying to new build every time we, like, we do a stream. That's why I've been taking like a day in between to learn some things, like, like research like spells and stuff. Uh, and then we do the, the invasion stream. At least that'll be the order for a little while, because, like, man, it's so cool trying everything out. Yo, Josiah, not gonna lie, the Dragon Bust spell should just be removed. It's pretty insane. I'm not I'm not gonna say it should be removed, but uh, maybe they shouldn't stagger you. Uh, the damage is, is definitely on the high end, but the real problem with it is it knocks you down, and then you get up and you get hit by it again. If it just hit you, I could deal with it. I think that might be a way to balance the Dragon Flame and stuff. Thank you. It would still be very strong, but at least lie. the dragon breath you know. spells should just be removed, Demo fellas. They're so stupid. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, there's a lot that they do that's a little powerful. I'm coming, Red. Survive. I never get teammates, Red. I got, I got Harry here. You need to leave, Red. Leave, 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 leave. Oh, you fool. I got them off you, so it's fine, I guess. Moon Veil, huh? Let's see how you fare against Ice Veil. That's right, I never stop R1-ing because I'm a Katana user. We just, we just R1 for the fun of it. I bet you love your Moon Veil. We dodge this. I know how to roll catch. <laughs> Good job, other teammate. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Good job. Good work, Slayer of Demons. I guess it was like part of the wizard rule to hit my teammate once. <laughs> that worked out. They are pretty slow, yeah. The the dragon spells are on the slow side. You can knock them out of it, but like I guess I think of it more as when you're fighting a team, but I mean everything can be overpowered when you're fighting a team, right? So, host vanquished. Oh no, <laughs> yo, nameless. Thank you guys so much. I honestly hope you guys have been enjoying <laughs> uh, Elden Ring. I'm sorry, Trips. That was you. Stop hitting us. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I have a I have a bad habit of hitting my teammate. Moon Veil is Vestige. Let's go try some water stuff. Or, you know, I like the castle. It just sucked that that guy was just camping that ledge, you know? There's so much cool stuff in the castle, to be honest. Um, I'll do a few more here, actually. We're getting really fast invasions here. Yeah. <laughs> this, is, this is definitely the hot spots. The legacy dungeons are definitely going to be the hot spots. For sure. Uh, the bleed, I mean, so you can still dodge the bleed proc. Oh my god. I'm going to change to a different part of this area, though. We keep getting fog walled. Yeah, Brandon, I do. I do. Uh, it's all over these areas, though. Like, if I, if I do this for you guys, like, the whole castle is just always active, so I just I just go wherever, to be honest. Well, this character is 60. Uh, in about, like, halfway through the stream, I'm going to try 70, see where we go, maybe? And then when we do the dual wield one, I'm not sure what kind of level we want to be at. Post vanquished. Thank you so much, though, Nameless Man. I appreciate all the support, guys, of your lovely little wizard. No point down emote. <laughs> I don't even, I forget that we can crouch half the time. The crouch works for some weapons, but mostly ultras because you get the thrust forward. Oh yeah, I love here. This is a cool battleground. We get the bridge, with the vertical height up there. Maybe we can use the bow. Oh, wait. Is he in the area? Yeah. This is weird. Oh wait, they're in here. Are they in here? Are they over here? What the hell? No? Are they above, maybe? Yeah, I think they're above me. Oh, they're out here. Oh, follow me, little guys. Don't fear the sword, it's beautiful. Katanas, they have an interesting rolling L1, though. That's cool. Haha, -ha, you've been dented. Blood slash. 
Okay, I need to remember my map here. This area is very strange. Okay, we got a few more stomps in us, then we'll recharge and maybe do our agiles in the light. Oh! Huh. Okay, mine and the Sun Bros connection might be a little bit strange. Okay, that doesn't have the longest range. I really thought Bloody Slash did more. Like, range-wise. It's not the strongest. He's trying to do the weapon art to make it so I can't S this. Ah, uh, got it. I guess I can't tank the weapon art of that. What? What? Okay, the the connections need to be definitely improved, though. Can we just talk about that? <laughs> that happens from time to time. That one didn't seem like a quit out. That one seemed like a legit, like connection issue. Although I did say that the sunbro was a bit on the laggy side, so I guess it's kind of to be expected. Damn, I used a lot of FP though. I gotta be careful when I do that shit. <laughs> yeah, that's so sad, dude. That happened once earlier too, right at the end, I guess. Like, we were gonna kill the host, but still. It's rough when that happens. Hey. Oh. Samurai. Uh, I, I, yeah, see what I'm talking about? I'm pretty sure the Sunbro lagged out. <laughs> okay, maybe, maybe don't use that in his face, Chase. Okay, now we've trained him, though. We've trained him, see? Mind games. You, you use the bow in their face so they think you're dumb. And then the next time you cast the OP sword that trades. Yes. New tactics. <laughs> Oh man, this has been going really well. Probably too well for being a wizard. Big brain strats, but first you need to use little brain strats. <laughs> it's funny. Dishonest wizard. <laughs> hey, I'm a filthy wizard. I'm cute though. I like my little armor set we got going on here. I feel like it flows nicely. What is the staff? Uh, it's called the meteor meteorite staff. You get it in Kaled uh, in the poison swamp. Well, toxic scarlet rot swamp. Man, too many souls games with too many swamps. Oh yes, yeah. sometimes you must become your enemy though. Sometimes you have to embrace the wizard to understand it better, to fight it better. You know, that is the wizard way. Hello there. De Gricotta? De Gricotta. Alright. We'll pebble him first. Make him think I'm all but a normal wizard. Give him a nice roll attack. There we go. Touch him when he doesn't want to be touched. Like a, like the, the dishonest wizard that we are. Oh! Holy shit, that scared me, zombie. Alright, onto the bridge. You know what he doesn't know about yet? Ice. No damage, though. For some reason. Also his thing. Maybe on the bridge it doesn't work well? No, it worked that time, so I'm confused. Ooh, ah. Hello. I'm a frost wizard here. I'm just coming by. So oh, wait, what hit him? Is that my hit from earlier? Did the ice take effect? I'm confused. I'll give you a bow though, sir. Uh, actually, bow. I gotta use it like that, okay. What the hell? <laughs> right? <laughs> Did he maybe feel like get the, the frostbite damage late? I have no idea. I'm very confused at that one, to say the least. Power of the base cannon of the wizard cannon. Yeah. 
Uh, well, I found so far like 12 of the larval tiers, I believe. 11 for sure, but I think I used one. So at least like 11 or 12 times in a playthrough, you can uh, reallocate. Also, Salted. Salted Cod, thank you so much for the membership, man. Oh, why did I always... You know what? I spawned back here. It's kind of good cover, but that could be bad in the long run. Hello, Kali. Hello. All right, so let's go. Let's go for the other wizard to claim our title of, of li wizard lord. Lizard lord is what I almost just said. I ducked your moon veil. Oh my god, that was cool. <laughs> you can do that. All right, noted. Looking sick. <laughs> Actually, so cool. When you do that was the most anime fight I've ever seen. Alright. Stop it! To jump attack! Good trade, Callie. Good trade. Fun fight, though. That was a clean one, to be honest. And the backstab worked. Wow. That felt like a normal invasion. <laughs> That's the, I don't know if crouching works, I, or the, the stomp. I mean, there was a slight hill, and I ducked from the stomp. Oh, as a summon. Oh, KSP. Okay, so I understand it now then. Okay, so in your own world, you can't farm the, the spheres that drop the larval tiers, but as a summon, because you get lots of the loot with your teammate... You can actually farm them that way. You just gotta put your name down before that area and get summoned. That is huge. I'm gonna try that tonight in my own time to see if I get a lot of them. That'd be useful for my, my builds that I'm showcasing for you guys. I switch them basically every day. Well, every other day. I don't think crouching has dodging properties. I think I just missed because the hitboxes are pretty clean in this game for the most part if the connection is good. Um, but yeah, it's hard to say. I have the finger. It's right here. Ah, uh, I just I just bind my finger to the to the pouch so I can hit triangle at right, like this. So I just I guess you don't see it pop up because I hit it so quick. That. Yeah, that's huge. Yeah, like uh, try. Yeah, reallocation has always been very important in the Souls games, in my opinion. If you're down for the PvP, because there's so much to try. If you had to make a build from scratch every time just for a weapon you would be running the game like hundreds upon hundreds of times so uh, there's always been reallocation in the souls games at the very least i'm happy about that oh we could try somewhere that we don't go off in what about here where even is this northern leonia lake let's try that Uh, well, you have to beat the second boss first. It's it's basically in the castle that I've been invading in. Nameless, thank you for the membership, man. Four talisman slots? Yeah, yeah. I got four talisman slots. You get the last one by killing uh, the golden godwin uh, in the capital. Uh, no, there's no durability. Thank God. Durability was like one of the worst things. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know the invasion and summon range. Like, no, I don't think anybody really does yet. That might require, unless someone found the fourth. Uh, Proficient, no, I got the fourth in one. You mean the fifth? No, I have a friend who's been going through New Game Plus, just like kind of melting the bosses with the, the, the Sword of Night and Flame, and uh, he never got more talismans. Yeah, you get the fourth just by, by killing Golden Godwin. I got it on this character for that reason. <clears throat> Um, okay, let's try to find them this way. Yeah, in a playthrough, if you go quality, you try out a lot of weapons, but to be honest, there are a lot of faith in, in scaling weapons as well, so it's it's tough. It, you get a, a good base of the weapons, though. Hello, boys. Hello. Another one summoned. Honestly? That weapon art probably hits hard, but it doesn't hit often. 
Can we just take a second to uh, appreciate that? Okay, no damage. See, that's what I'm talking about. There's a few no damage things. Like, I feel like he should have got hit by that, but he didn't. And he definitely didn't dodge it. So there are definitely some weird connection issues sometimes. Bam! Oh, that was so clean. The strafing. Sometimes, man, the hitboxes in this game are just beautiful. Like, actually so good. Fun fight, Arnaud. We're gonna strafe around them. The magic bonk is very satisfying, yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> I actually like that hammer a lot. It's not as strong as the sword. I'd probably be killing them if I used the sword one that I have, but how satisfying is it to just splat somebody with a magic hammer? It's like, it's so fun. <laughs> okay, we'll do a few more here, but the battleground isn't that cute. I want water. Hello, what's up, Ash? How goes your day, man? We're, we're a filthy wizard today. It's been fun. There we go. Bonk? Thank you, Nameless. Thank you. Uh, I'm waiting for 150 for most of the player base to get to 150. Uh, I have friends who are like are in the 120s and they don't get a lot of PvP still. You guys gotta give people time to get there. So I'm just doing mid to like 90 invasions until then. Maybe in like a couple days to try it and see. If it's more active, but for a stream, I want to be invading like the whole time. Hooah! I'm a wizard. That hit him. Oh, and then I frostbit him. Well, ignore the wizard for a second. Okay, we can't ignore the wizard any longer. It's just become a hindrance in my backside. Okay, those have more range than you would think they would. They go on forever. Jeez, that's pretty cool though. But damn. Right, maybe we'll kill the wizard first. It's out of juice. Oh, yeah, you might want to respect the, the wizard sword a little bit here. Buddy. It does some pretty hefty damage. Does that reach all the way here? Holy, that is some range on that. That's a good team tool then. 100%. I mean, maybe that for the wizard, to be honest. Yeah. Wizard needs to die. Yeah. There we go. Ah, uh, I thought... Okay, I guess poise resetting, I still don't understand fully. Oh, also, there's a lot of latency, I guess. He takes that really late. Bam! Oh, that would have been such a finish. Fun fight, Mr. Face. <laughs> he had a cute little face, I guess. Yeah! Wizard warrior, battle mage. It has potential. Get the arc spell. Yeah, you know what? That dude, what is that range? Actually, hold up. That guy, that wizard is on to something. <laughs> That wizard is on to something. Thank you. Uh, memorize spell. Which one is that? Actually, I don't think I have it. Where do we get that? Glintstone Arc. I must have missed a... Uh... Oh, it's right there. I'm dumb. I'm so dumb. Maybe that's better than this. 5 FP, 10 FP. We'll get rid of uh, the, the base cannon. <laughs> All right, there we go. I do have it. I'm just blind. Okay, let's go more into the watery area. It's kind of pretty. Um, here, let's try. I would go here. By the way, if you guys want to access all of Elden Ring, do Ronnie's questline because this whole area you cannot get to without doing Ronnie's questline. So like, and there's other things as well. Just wanted to throw that out there. If you're doing a playthrough, that might be the one thing you want to look into. Might be the one thing. Thank you, Cameron, though. Bonk, bonk. What's a good level? A uh, low level? Um, I'm not sure about low level. 60 has been hitting, like, a lot of... You can even get the, the castle still from time to time. I got some invasions in the castle. Uh, all the way up to Atlas Plateau. Basically, like, I would say half the map can be accessed. Or, like, 
I guess 40% can be accessed with level 60. This might be like level 30. Kalid might be like level 80, I guess, to 100. And then maybe the mountaintop at like 140 when people start getting up there. So. Thirty to fifty in Stormvale is pretty fun. Okay, so yeah, that's that's kind of what I guessed. The thirty for the first area, forty I guess on the higher end. I'm level one twenty and never able to. Yeah, bread because no one's level one. Well, like some people are level one twenty, but what you need to know is like most of the player base of this game just got this game right. They're not all like holy shit, what just happened over there? They're not all like super high level yet. Like I just did like the ram roll, I think. Hey, dude. Hey. <laughs> I just came into a spinning lightning attack that killed them. <laughs> oh yeah, golden art. Yeah, yeah, you can't get there unless you do the Ronnie quest line. Most people I know get to the Halig tree at 120. Yeah, that sounds about right. I was, I would have been higher. I stopped the leveling to buy a bunch of stuff. So I would have been like 140 when I beat the game, I think, if I didn't personally stop myself at 125. Uh, what have I liked uh, so far? Is deck strength sorcery or incantations? Um, oh, uh, I haven't really done strength int yet because I've only done this, which is I guess more dex leaning, but it's it's straight up intelligence for the most part. I don't really have much dex. I have base dex, and then my ring is giving me like five in a couple stats. Uh, what weapon? Uh, this is just the Uchi Katana. I have a few. I can use the rapier. We can try out the rapier a little bit. Um, and then uh, we have a dagger that I haven't upgraded that's int. <laughs> I'm going to upgrade that eventually. And then I have moon veil. And then I have uh, two staffs. Yeah, to be honest, it, it doesn't tell you how to get here, right? You come up in an elevator after killing a really interesting boss, which I won't spoil for the Ronnie quest line, but... Yeah, you, you cannot access this area entirely without that. So keep that in mind. If you want to know where Ronnie is, she's over at Ronnie's Rise. You'll find her there, and then you can start her like quest line. Can you do wield crossbows? I'm pretty sure you can, yeah. Pretty sure you can do wield anything. Oh, I, I don't. I just think Moonvale's a little bit strong, and I'm kind of keeping like a theme of an ice wizard. You know what I mean? I'm just, I'm just icing it up, trying, but we have added a few. A lot of not ice spells at this point, I guess. That's true, but hey, our most powerful ones are still ice, so it's fine. Where's this Vihander quick step? That'll come eventually. I gotta do a build today, man. It takes time. Okay, I'll go back to the, the bait parlor. It seems to be more active. I did do the quest line on my first playthrough, yeah. I've done the Ronnie quest line on all of them, just because it gives you more stuff. Like, there's more ac there's more things you access through it, so. Oh, the dragon scale. That's more dex, though. That doesn't scale off int, I believe, right? So. Oh. Well, Ronnie's there first, but she's asleep uh, eventually, Mark. So it depends on how far you progress in the game. But yeah, you have to kill Radon to continue her quest line. Indeed. <laughs> that was sucky. I had to do that as well. Honestly, I feel like Radon was harder than like Morgoth and like the end game bosses at this level. I'm gonna be real with you, Radon was rough. <laughs> uh, Dex or Dex Arcane, it really depends on if you want to use uh, Bleed or if you just want like high Riot damage, because that's really the answer to it right there. You want Bleed, you do Arcane for the Bleed scaling. Uh, there's only a few Arcane Dex weapons though, I guess, that you would love. They're all Katanas for the most part. Um, and then Pure Dex would just give you access to more weaponry, I guess. Oh, wait. Okay, they have this shortcut open. That's... Wait. Wait. They're up top? There's the EPA. The, like, the Great Rapier. Yeah. What's it called? Great Thrust... Uh, heavy Thrusting Swords is the class. Yeah. That's something you can use as well. Bloody Helis' Dex Arc. Yeah, so is the... Uh, well, I mean, the scaling on all the Arcane weapons, for the most part, doesn't work at the moment, though, so... Maybe hold off on that, really? Maybe hold off on the decks or on the arcane and see what they do if they patch it or if it's actually intended. Because if it's not intended, I don't know why they have scaling letters. And if it is, 
Those weapons suck, and they're weak compared, so. Uh, Dre, what boss was the hardest in the game for me? Hmm. So in my first playthrough, I died like new, like for like two, two, two to three hours to Melania using a katana, because it couldn't stun her. And then I switched to a halberd, and I one-tried her while it stunned her from the light attack, so it, it's hard to say. I'd have to fight them with multiple weapon types, you know, but if, if I went off like time spent on it, it would be Melania and then I guess Radon. For me. Yeah, I actually tried it without the NPC summons on this character, Paladin, and I feel like his health bar gets bigger. I don't know if I'm weird, but it seemed a little easier without them. Uh, and I tried summoning one close to the end when he was like almost dead as just a distraction, not the whole army. I feel like I killed him faster that way, but it's hard to say unless I fight it a couple times like that. Maybe. I mean, there's just so many people playing this game. Some are just going to be on Wi-Fi and stuff. Yeah. Okay, we'll go. We'll go to a different area. Everyone here is just dying to disconnect. Have you seen that glitch with Fire's Deadly Sin and the Eclipse? Showed I have, with Mark. I have. Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's pretty dumb, I'm not gonna lie. The NPC gold summons definitely make them tankier, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Because <laughs> I summoned like all of them in my first playthrough and I was like, this man has the health bar of God. But then in this playthrough when I was level 50, I was, I was definitely chunking him more, so... It really depends on your build, I guess, if it's better to summon or not. Here we go. Groove. Oh man, uh, maybe this area just a lot of people are already at the boss when you get summoned. The spawn points are the only thing I'm going to say could use some work in Elden Ring. They spawn you like relatively, I guess sort of close, but like they don't take into account the vertical area that you're in. There we go. Radon, you could, yeah, the comet always gets me the first time I played. Okay, I'll go to a different area. We'll go to the water where they can't fog wall as much. To the water! Uh, mostly respects so far, Latara. I did make a second build, though. Uh, this is my second one. As apart from my new character, or my original character. Yeah, that happened to me today, Dre. We uh, were invading in the Carrion Manor, which I like a lot, by the way. Invading in the Royal Manor. It's super cool, but maybe we'll go there, actually. It's really cool. I just had this one team sitting on a ledge that you can't get to because you need to go through the boss room. And now that I'm thinking about it, how the hell? Oh, I guess, sorry. Yeah, once they beat the boss, they can go there, I guess. Um, a wax dust item would be awesome where you can just like search everywhere on the map without going there. I think that's optimal. I don't know if we'll get that though. Oh, we could also try going underground. I didn't even think about that. I forgot that's a place. There's wizards down there. It kind of fits the theme. We could try that shit. Hello there. Oh, we had to try to cheese the hand, Catherine. Dishonest wizard. I have to aggro that. Yeah. It does like a pre-explosion. Honestly, that's pretty cool. Fire, do oh, fire does sort of burn. <laughs> the old caster in the back. Roll catch. Damn, I thought I could. I got springy G. What about this? Oh, that's pretty good. The range on that is definitely going to help a lot. Super useful. Let's get a tier going here. There we go. Get our FP back. I think I don't see you, buddy. Nice, that's hitting. That could be bad. But not bad enough, apparently. Oh yeah, clutch heal. Clutch cover. They always sneak around behind my camera. <laughs> Definitely throws me off. Oh, that hit me before it should have hit me, that's for sure. 
worth the trade for sure. The madness build up onto that one isn't too strong. You kind of dodge that pretty efficiently. Come back here, Catherine. Oh wow, I missed. That one didn't though. <laughs> oh, that's a big boy spell. I want to break his thing. Whoa! That guy's got some gnarly spells. That'll break his bubble. Huge, yes. Oh, sneaky Catherine, sneaky. I need the running attack that's better on this as opposed to my uh, other one. Bap. Damn, if this one was, uh, if he wasn't so teleporty, it would be nice. I wouldn't even mind. He's got a little teleport action going on anytime he does any type of attack, though. He's a little bit on the skippy side. Nice. And then that guy with that range. Oh, the regen is definitely helping a lot right now. It's super useful. I wonder if we get. I, I would try jumping it, but. At least that stuns. Frostbitten again, that's good. Nice, the roll catch is so useful. Oh, I thought that would work in his face. It didn't though. Alright, we get him with the hammer. He's kind of panic rolly. Bam! Oh, you're cheating. You're cheating me. I deserve that hit. I deserved it. Oh, the most aggressive wizard you've ever seen. Dodging still as good as ever, I see. Honestly, roll spam is hard to punish in this for sure. There we go, I'll take the trade. <laughs> Fun fight, Spongy. Or what was his name? Spongy? Spongy. No, oh, it's from the flask. My region is from my flask. Uh, it's a little on the strong side for sure, Squishy. It's one of the more strong weapon arts in the game. They, uh, uh, it's hard to roll catch. Well, that was just because our connection wasn't too great, but um, people with like uh, some packet loss are hard to catch, I guess, for sure. It's like, it's like sort of, it's smoother than all the other ones, but DS3 still feels a little smoother in terms of movement. I'm with you, Ash, like a little bit. I feel like they made the, the rolls a little bit less distance as well. That's definitely something I noticed. Hey, that looks interesting. It's the God Slayer. We're gonna not go near that right away. See, it seems like he has some power within spell going on. I'm hesitant to aggress whatever that aura is. It's not like building up anything on me though, so it's fine. Can we stop this? <laughs> that was a little bit on the excessive side of the roll attack. Oh, that's why he was doing it. The range is high. Take 
like this. Aw, oh, I thought that would hit. Nice. Ooh, I knew our connection was weird, but damn. That was extra weird. Ooh, fun fight though, Bambo. Where's your host though? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, that was the host. Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah. Death status? Oh my god, dude. As if there's a death build up weapon. That's crazy. <laughs> what the hell? I didn't expect to see that. That's funny. <laughs> oh, that's good. Great teammate. Just watched him die. Definitely of the best of the teammates. Ooh, this is an interesting spawn. Defeat Holy. Well, if he's not a faith build, we riot. Um, okay, they have this shortcut. I still don't know this area fully for all of its shortcuts possible. There's a ladder here. He was just there to film the fight. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Okay, this obviously isn't where they are though, is it? No. Can I jump here? Man. Yeah, I mean, it was. A, I never expected them to have a, a weapon that builds up curse in Dark Souls 3, and they didn't. And I didn't expect one to be in this, but they, but they have one. I, I, that, was, that was an interesting choice. <laughs> Best teammate. <laughs> that is Watch. Uh, yeah, I know it's crazy the distance you get on the uh, blood. Is it the bloodhound quick step, right? Bloodhound step is its actual name Okay, I guess they just progressed up Maybe we'll try the warp Thank you so much though, uh, I will try that eventually step is basically I just feel like it's not the most interesting of the attacks Is this better? Am I closer to them now? Are they still even in a weirder area. Can you get up there? This way. I know, I saw someone's health bar die. I just, I have no idea where they are. Up here? Dude, they're like, not even in the castle, it seems. Oh. That's definitely, oh! My jump didn't work. <laughs> Why did he just run, dude? I was spamming X. Oh, so sad. <laughs> so sad. <laughs> Fucking jump. <laughs> Good jump, Chase. Thank you. Listen, to be fair, six years of Dark Souls involves clicking the analog, okay? I'm not used to X. Ah, <laughs> uh, my two deaths in this game so far, PvP-wise, have been to jumping off cliffs. <laughs> that, that's fitting, though. That's fitting. There we go, whatever, we're closer here. It's so weird. Like, I did click X, though. He just, I think I was in the air when I clicked it. Alright, come here. I'm hot off a gravity death. It can't be much worse than that. Poison! Ooh, that's interesting. That's not, I've seen a lot of lightning. Come at me, katana user. I am a fellow. Oh, ambush, ambush, ambush in the streets. Where was he? Go up. I don't know where I'm going. We're going to a dead end. This is bad. We're going to have to turn and burn. No, we're not going to turn and burn. Yeah, we're dead. Heal. Oh, uh, well, we got by him, but... Oh, heal. Dodge. That katana can probably poke me from where he is, but we're not going to let that happen. Perfect. We're good. We're countering the poison. We need to make an opening. 
and I need to cure this poison. We're good. They wasted two of my heals though, you bitches. With your range. Oh, he's actually firing at the enemies, I see. They like to fight in a three-man, so we will try to avoid that as best we can. And our regen is going right now. This is fine for now. Pebble. Dodge. 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 <laughs> Have more of that? Jeez. Oh hell no. It's okay, that does drain a lot of FP. It's not like you can do that much more, so we're okay. Oh, they're gonna kind of come fight now, huh? Wow. Much skill in that guy. And that guy. <laughs> they can only 3v1 you in a circle. Pathetic. Pathetic gankers. <laughs> wow. Got him. Thank you. Will you be showing off the moon veil this stream? Uh, I have used it a little bit, but I'm, I'm more going for an ice theme right now than the moon veil. Uh, well, it's a quality weapon, Golden Arc, so it doesn't match with my stats. <laughs> Everything for me is scaling off in right now. Ooh. Ice is pretty powerful. Uh, the ice sword, too. I gotta hit it more. We got, like, a couple double kills earlier. It was beautiful. But just to bait them into the swing. Oh. Hello, boys. That hurts them more than it hurts me. I can fire it. Hey. Oh, I guess I don't have the... Oh, you know what I'm not wearing, actually? I forgot to put this back. Oh, wait. Oh, because my game crashed. Yeah. Well, not my game. My internet. <laughs> my internet died. I haven't had my sorcery boost ring on. That's disappointing. What is this yellow line I'm seeing? Parkour. Need FP back. You think I don't see you? Filthy wizard. I wonder if this can tank Matt. No. But is this some like sorcery or was that the host? What's going on here? <laughs> wizards. Filthy wizards. Even though I'm one of them. <laughs> That's funny. I uh, know I'm, I'm not saying it's better. I'm just using it to use it. You know what I mean? The moon veil is very strong, but this just fits my aesthetic right now. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's try to land more of the moon blade. Now that we have the buff sword, that makes a lot of sense. I didn't have my buff ring on. <laughs> Pot calling. <laughs> oh my god, that's funny. That's true though. I'm currently a wizard. I can't complain about wizards. Um, okay. Oh. Damn it. Okay, we'll try. Yeah, I love the Rivers of Blood moveset, but yeah, it's bugged and doesn't scale. I'm gonna try other. Hello! Why, hello, boys! Ooh, hang on a second, I'll read that in a sec, squishy. Ah, uh, but. Hello there! We have Hosfelion. Do you think he'll be ready for this? The answer was no. No, he was definitely not ready for that. He had no idea what was coming. <laughs> 
Oh, well, that is the weakest moon veil I've ever seen. I want to I get it with the hammer more. Okay, that, that one did more damage. Uh, mm, what? I'm not, I'm not really sold on what the hell that was. Hey, take my ice, buddy. Respect the wizard ice mage. Frozen wizard, I don't know. <laughs> this sword is cool, though. Very cool. Uh, Squishy Boo, uh, have you tried Glint Blade in PvP? Uh, that's what I'm using right now, right? Or wait, maybe I'm not. Glint Blade, as in, is it a buff? Or, I think I might have it. That name sounds very familiar. Memorize spells. I'm not going to switch it out or anything, but... Is that the sword buff? No. I don't know what Glint Blade is, then. I have not tried Glint Blade yet. I guess I don't have it, uh, Squishy Boo. Oh, right by the fire giant. That's kind of what I assumed at first, but I want meta to be like everywhere. I don't want to just invade the mountaintop area. Magic glint blade. Oh, is that wait? Ow. My toe. It's the start. Oh, oh, the like almost like carrion piercer or Oh, is that the one that like hovers above and it's kind of like waits to cast? Yes, yes, yes. I know what you're talking about. It definitely applies pressure the whole time it's there because people aren't sure when it's going to fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what that is. I was just forgetting entirely. Um. Yeah, I, I have that syntax. I plan to use that on uh, maybe the Naga Kiba. It has more range anyway, so I want to try out some other Katana builds. Let's see. Uh, Dave, yeah, no problem, man. There's my stats currently. Maybe pause it right there. There's a hand here. Going great, Elden Ring. <laughs> Playing the hell out of you. Hello, Katal. Hello, brother. Hey! Wait, did I say that when I waved? Or... Hey. Wait. I, I, how of this time I have, I've not known the entire time that that happens? What in the hell? I didn't even know that. The untouchable war. That is not what I wanted to cast, but I'll take it. I wanted to cast my sword. <laughs> ah, bad. I'm at a wizard juice. I think he knows this. Wait, you dare gank when I didn't even know you exist? <laughs> Interesting. Fun fight though. And it landed, yeah. <laughs> I was trying to land the, the super sword attack. That's really funny. As you can see, I haven't been a wizard yet in this game. It's uh, It's been an experience to say the least. We could try, what about over here? I've never really been over behind. That might be a good place to invade, so I can't get cheesed by that ledge. Try this out. It's pretty here. It's raining, you know. Got some fancy trees to cover us from other wizards. Too little, too late. I know, man. He was too late, man. I know there's the ones that you can be like, hello, hello. Or like the, the deep pumpkin. Thank you. It's like deep, but also a whisper like, thank you. I don't know. That's my best attempt. His summon was hiding in a bush the whole time, waiting for optimal sneak attack, but it never came. Yeah, Radagon, I definitely agree for sure. He's so annoying. <laughs> but like, it's a cool boss fight. We gotta hand that to the to the boss fight itself. It's unique. Oh. There's a you're beautiful. Uh, yeah, I think I actually do have that on this one. I <laughs> Yeah, I found that on stream. That was so funny. Oh, God. Help Me has been in, like, all of the Souls series, so that one's always good. 
help me. Yeah, it was hard. You know what the problem with the Radagon fight and why it's so hard is just the damn horse makes him move so quickly. And he has a dual wield weapon. So like you gotta frame perfect the dodge or you get caught by one of the swords. All while he's moving too quick for you to outrun. So I definitely made it more difficult. A fellow wizard! You're just wasting your FP, Tychus. I haven't used that spell yet, but I don't want to just out of spite of everybody using it. <laughs> Wizard! That's how wizards fight, with magic swords. Why are you crouching? What are we waiting on here? I don't even know if he knows he's crouched. Tychus, it's just me and you unless you got some teammate I don't know about. Indeed he does. Okay. I mean, the running away strat only works if you actually involve yourself in the fight after, you know what I mean? Like, if you just run away forever, they're gonna just... I see timed his attack different. That only works when you have a summon. I guess people are used to that. They have like a teammate to aggress while they just run away. <laughs> the moon veil. <laughs> but it's like eventually something will happen if I escape. <laughs> My favorite FromSoft game. Definitely Elden Ring so far in terms of like overall. There are some things that I think that Dark Souls 3 does better in PvP for sure. But Elden Ring is going to constantly receive updates. So I think it has the potential to be the best if they keep working on it and updating the, the online mechanics of it. In my opinion. But it's a lot more fun right now, for sure. There's so much to do, so much to learn. I'm loving it. Oh yeah, is Godric weak to bleed? I, I didn't really use any bleed weapons on Godric. I, oh, I had a katana, but I don't remember bleeding him, to be honest. Also, I guess the game crashes from time to time. I'm pretty sure it's gonna... You know what's weird about it? It'll do this, where it's like frozen, but I can actually interact with it and change those those sentences. See that? Armament customization, supportive objective, supporting, summoning spirits. Like, I'm interacting with the game right now, but it's definitely frozen. <laughs> it's a really interesting thing that'll happen every, like, I don't know, three, four hours to me. I think it's been happening once a stream, but yeah, I'm gonna have to close the game. <laughs> Oh my god, or That's the longest loading time I've ever seen. Hold up. Hold up. What am I? Connecting to the moon? <laughs> what? This is the first time I didn't crash. That was so long. That took forever. What the hell? Can I get back up there? Man, and this type of... <laughs> you take the moon and you get the moon. <laughs> Where? Why did I spawn out here? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> this game. Oh, is that him? Oh. This man must be from the moon, but we'll try. We gotta see how it goes. I stomp first to test the connection. Coming attack. My own. Oh. One shot. <laughs> uh, I was actually aiming that at the phantom, but my auto lock hit him instead because it goes by where you're facing, not where your camera is. So that was. That was definitely interesting. <laughs> Batted him right out of the air. <laughs> He was all in with that one. Arms extended, curved swords in the air, just sword swipe to the face. Dead. That was funny. <laughs> yeah, magic can hit really hard, but they're, I guess they're easy to dodge, so you really need to try your best to uh, trade into it, I guess, or like perfectly spaced. It is hard, but we've landed that. We got a double kill with that earlier. That was really cool. Um, oh, 
okay. Top 10 anime deaths right there, for sure. That was funny. That was a home run. <laughs> yes. It's out of here. Uh, oh, okay. Other side of the mountain, I guess. I've invaded some phantoms that seem super tanky with super high health. I don't know how the matchmaking works with like spirit summons. I mean, fan uh, password summons in this and like how high it can go. But we've definitely fought some really high level ones that have been tanky as hell. Yesterday, or well not yesterday, the day before, I remember a specific fight that took forever. He was so tanky. Um, oh, this fight, okay. The jump is get it, taking some getting used to. Like sometimes you'll be on a ledge like this and you can't roll it. And you're so used to doing that in Dark Souls, but... <laughs> Fellow wizard! Obscure! Oh, he's got the Oki... No oh, God. I think that's Moonvale. Oh, God, it's Melania! Round two of Melania! Now I gotta fight her all over again. Wow. That rock really messed me up. That, that's gonna hurt a lot, yeah. Point blank range with the moon veil is damage. Oh, he's, oh, he's laggy! Oh, that should not have hit me, but I guess whatever, okay. We'll take it, I guess. That was like the after image technique. I don't even know how to... Oh, well. It's fighting weeks. Just a natural occurrence. Guess I can dodge that. This guy's just running away from me. He hasn't actually like attacked in a while. Cover. At least he wasted FP doing that. Oh god, I want to fight the Phantom because the host is literally just a, like a lag lord. Phantom seems like healthy though, like internet wise. Oh, can I not strafe that? Okay. Why are we running? <laughs> okay, once the summon's dead, we'll be fine, because he's gonna come in here. And sneak attack me. Oh, he ate the freaking. Oh, I know exactly what he did. You sneaky little weasel. He ate the, the thing that gives you health if you're poisoned. For being poisoned. It's basically like the sea brows of this game. Bruh! I don't know how we're gonna kill Lag Boy, but we will eventually. It's weird to me that you don't even want to participate in the fight, sir. Ah, Jesus. Oh, God. He died to poison. Perfect, you little fuck boy. Come here. Oh, my God. Okay, the only thing that saddens me in this game is the internet connection, sometimes. He's rolling off a cliff. Good. That's where you belong. In the grave. <laughs> Junichiro. Jesus. <laughs> that kind of fight is my least favorite kind of fight. Wow. <laughs> he runs away when he's alone. What a coward. 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 <laughs> 
Uh, I'm not really Aaron. I didn't find myself proccing my own madness too often because I, I didn't just like weapon art or spell spam, so. <laughs> he ran away well. Askel. He ran away well. He had the skill of running. I'll give him that. There's my Canadian comment. <laughs> Hello there, Ice. Ice, Ice, baby. That's fire. That's disgusting fire. Whoa! Oh, that would have been so cool. I'm trying to be like super aggro. Oh, I jumped your moon veil. How does it feel? Man, it's like, you're right. You guys are right, though. There's a lot of moon veils. Like an obscene amount of them. <laughs> That's right. That blue fire marks your grave. Show him the ice. The ice born. Lance, of course, man. That's like the, the replay value to me is the online that it has. Let's go check out. Let's go back to the castle. It seemed like when I got the fights there, they were a lot better. Oh, actually, we fought a couple of them, Raul. There's been like three, three swords of night and flame today, I would say. But I mean, it's pretty easy to dodge the weapon art, the, the beam one anyway. Not as annoying. Ooh, carry and slicer could be cool. I haven't, Wilder. 60 and above is Moonvale territory. <laughs> that explains a lot of my Moonvale encounters today. Ooh. Oh, thank you, Elden Ring. I've just always been a huge fan of the Souls games. Always a great time. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. This... It's it's interesting. You could maybe it really depends on your playstyle. You could t dial down the vigor and get more mind, but I like tanking some things. It's more of like a battle mage than a, a pure wizard, like a frost battle mage. Let's go. Thank you, Dylan. I was gonna do that too. <laughs> oh, what does it actually do, Mad Hunter? Someone told me about mo. Oh, you can go in here. As an invader? Oh, they're up there. How do I get up there? Ladder. I get up there with the ladder. This will be an interesting battle spot. What? This is so cool. That box doesn't belong! I sensed it! <laughs> <laughs> Try to hide on me, will you? <laughs> they were like together, you know, like it's okay, he won't notice us. <laughs> that was pretty funny. <laughs> it gives you a phantom great rune that increases the host enemies. Go on attack power and heals you. Oh god. Oh, we're definitely getting that for next stream. What the hell? That's amazing. You heal off them killing enemies? Damn. Damn. We doing that. That's okay for now though. What do you think will be the main PvP hub? I don't really know. The capital is pretty cool looking. I don't know what level is popular for there. Maybe we could try like 80 to 100 for the capital. Uh, with my dual wield build we're going to try next. I don't know what I want to do. Okay, so far we've tried like all the stat procs, I guess. Except for poison. I don't think a poison build will do very well though at anything but super low soul level. Maybe scarlet rot, but not actual poison. How many rune arcs do I have now? Huh, 50. <laughs> I think that's just from like today, honestly. Yeah, I've been wondering about the weapon level too. So like I, I found 60 plus 10 is solid. You get tons of action. So you know what? That that math adds up. If you're 90 plus 15, it's kind of like, you know, 1.5 times what I am. Soul level and weapon level. That sounds good, I guess. 
And it's pretty instant over there as well. Only with a horse. Oh, too bad you can't use the horse. Actually, I'm kind of happy you can't use the horse in PvP. Let's be a little real here. Actually, what about in here? I haven't really got an invasion in here. At 70 plus 15. Ooh. What's the equivalent of that somber? Is that like a plus... 6? Somber 6 at 70? Does that sound right? Yeah, the, the matchmaking is interesting to get used to because the world is so big, you know? Let's go try uh, somewhere in the water then. Because plus 5 somber would be like 12, right? Or 12.5. 10 somber is max. That's definitely not the equivalent. My weapon's at plus 4 right now. What would you go for? Somber? So yeah, if you're somber 4, you're in the range that I'm in right now. You could probably hit up all of Liurnia, all the way to Atlas Plateau, all the way to the manor here. Um, okay, so 7580 is probably a really good range for the capital. Plus 5 somber needs same grade materials like 15 regular. So yeah, that, that's true. I've wondered because they can't have decimal numbers, you know? That's why I've been a little confused. Maybe we can go near the dragon. Hold up. Let me just go get the grace point there that I somehow never grabbed while waiting for an invasion. But yeah, I guess it also... Wait, can I can I invade on my horse? Well, I'm not going to use the horse, but can I run and invade? Oh my god, I can. That's huge. Yeah, it should be, Sam. But then sometimes you end up at decimal numbers, right? So like a, a plus 5 somber at 2.5, right? Would be 12.5. So that's a little weird. Like, would you match with 13 based on that? Would you match with 12? I don't know. Does the level your weapon define? Yes, yes. So you don't want to be like level 20 with a max weapon. You won't get any online activity. It's always like that with the Souls games. Weapon and soul level match makes, so that way you can't be like stronger than who you're invading. It keeps the balance there. I mean, you're an invader. You're still going to be fighting like overpowered enemies, but... Hello there, Miriam. You think you can use the bow in my face? Wow, I got really good at roll catching with some things. Oh, he's... Oh, random host. Getting his butt kicked by the Urge Tree. Oh, why does everyone have a moon veil? <laughs> That's so common. You guys are right. I'm glad I haven't been using it. More diversity. I don't know what you're doing over there, but that wasn't the play, sir. That was not the play. <laughs> Gah, the, the Chad Uchi Gatana. Because <laughs> it's blue. It is cute. Okay, I get it. I get it. It's cool. I used it in my playthrough too. I can't complain. I cannot. <laughs> I need a waypoint. I want to go here. I want to see if we can invade and have someone see the dragon at the same time because that'd be hilarious. <laughs> I like the moon veil. I'm, I'm partly involved in the moon veil community. I can't judge. <laughs> You're right. I take it back. I'm not allowed to. There we go. Oh shit. Uh, I got a few of the endings. Um, well, no, sorry. You can. I got Ronnie ending. I know what a few of them are, though. I just chose uh, the Ronnie ending. Deathbird Ritual Spear. Oh, is that the Frost one? Where am I going? This way. The can do. Oh, there's a there's a candle. That's a whip. That's actually very good. Dark Souls Three called it wants its katana back. No. The Uchi Katana will always be part of my being. But Ronnie ending is definitely one of the best endings for sure. Ha! 
<laughs> yeah, I do see a lot of the Knight and Sword and Flame. Not the Sword of Knight and Flame. At least, like, if I had to say reoccurring weapons, that Moon Veil are probably some of the more seen ones. Kyo. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people don't get that. I love that people co-op in this game because it makes cool fights. As much as my commentary is Mimi, like uh, I'm saying dishonest gankers, like it's, I enjoy that. That's why I invade, you know? Because when you invade in this, you're not going to get 1v1s. Like they're, they're not going to happen, so you know, you just got to accept it. <laughs> you used both, Dre? Yeah, the, the Sword of Night and Flame is the, uh, definitely the... Four Belfries, that's an area we haven't really gone to. It's definitely the PvE murderer. Wait. Maybe near here. Let's try here. Yeah, hey, uh, it melts PvE. It's just like you use the weapon art beam and they're dead. Like, it's, it's definitely strong, for sure. For sure, for sure. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to the school deal. We were there a lot. I'm just trying to get a little, a few other areas. So when we make the, the PVP video for this, it's not just the school. As cool as the school is, it's definitely one of the cool areas to invade. A lot of the other areas are like planes. I like how when I go into other people's world, it's like different time of day as well. It's raining. Yeah, like, you definitely have to get more involved in the PvP, I guess, to be able to fight 3v1 comfy. It is hard, obviously. I mean, fighting outnumbered in any game is hard, for sure. Hello there, boys. A filthy, stinking wizard. I'm getting hit by that. Oh, oh that hit him, but... Not all the way. That was pretty goddamn good timing. Nice. Dodge. Avoid. Yes, get him, sniper. This is when you're like, when you're fighting 2v1 and 3v1, you have to really utilize the area as best you can. Any type of cover works from them just being able to aggress you constantly. Hello, man. Nice. Cover. And we waste his FP that way. That was the one thing we can use? There's definitely more this way, actually. I'm watching out. We watch our madness meter. A little teleporty, but that's okay. We watch our wizard self. Hmm. He went to regroup with his partner. Where'd he go? There's the host. There's the madness guy. They wanted to draw me away from cover. Oh, that range. Let's do this. <laughs> he wasn't prepared for that. Watch out for the build-up. Nice. The ultra guy's kind of just lingering. He's not really aggressing too much. I'm trying to bait him to come around. <laughs> I see him there.
Where's the other guy at? You never want to take your eye off both of them for too long. You need to know where they are so they can't just surprise roll catch you. That was really weird. That is a surprise roll which I was talking about. Oh, he jumped it. Like I jumped it too, damn. Fire regen's gone, okay. The host is going this way around, yep. The bots sometimes are freaking hilarious, dude. Man who's back to full health. You can't outsmart me. I'm a wizard. My entire build is int. Ultra guy is near. <laughs> he got stuck on a tree. I tried to get him to roll into that. Running low on that there FP, to be honest. Nice. Damn, they still have heals, huh? Jeez, this guy is like set. We've done quite a lot of damage to him, but not enough. I'm watching, I'm watching. I need FP back. to get rid of the really really scary one first and now we can aggress boom where's your gank now filthy ultra wizard tight fight though <laughs> and this will end very quickly now. Yes, they definitely use their number pressure well right there. Very fun fight though in the end. It was good. Uh, What's my character? Oh, well, it was a Vagabond. Oh, what do you mean a weapon upgrade? I'm level 60 with like plus 10s. Almost two years since we met. Yes, dude. Hell yeah. 23 months on the membership. Damn, bro. Yeah, the combat takes a while to get used to drift, for sure. I'm, I'm quite a lot of hours into the invading now, I guess. I'm getting used to it, but it is very different. For sure.
<laughs> yeah. That was funny, Ash. I was like, he's alone. <laughs> Die. <laughs> you have to avoid that Spears uh, phantom roll catch because all stats... Uh, ro Still, you know what bothers me, though? I think what they could do to make stat proc builds better and more balanced, I guess, is not make it build up on roll. But then they can be dodged. You know what I mean? So if you take that away, your, your stat proc buildup will be better overall because your bleed won't be dodged. Um, I think they need to do that. They make it so that the, the stat buildup doesn't proc when you hit people during a roll. That way it can't build up unfairly and you can't have it happen terribly to you as the stat proc user. You know what I mean? Like bleed builds sucked in Dark Souls 3 because, oh, he's about to get bled. I go hit him and they roll and then the bleed happens during the roll and they just take no damage. And it just makes it so all your weak hits on your weapon, you know, they were wasted. They could have been stronger hits from a dex build. So I think that that's better if they would have did that. I would be all for that. I don't know if they'll ever do that, but hey. Would definitely help out both sides. That's true. You can use the Tantra Tongue for that. Um, I don't know. You toggle them on and off. You mean the map? Yeah. You can see where a lot of activity is. I know, we're so old, bro. <laughs> we're old now. When Dark Souls 3 was but a baby. Ooh. That's an interest. What is that? What am I hearing? Bugs? Bugs? Is it just this guy? I mean, I mean, that's a good weapon art, but it's so easy to dodge. I don't get why people are always, like, gung-ho about it. You know what I mean? Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> the Blood Slash does a lot of damage, though. It does. It's just, it's such a narrow hitbox. I see a lot of people running it, and I know it's good for PvE, but it's really easy to dodge, I find. Personally, anyway. Sounds like Roger is rod. It does. It sounds like the flies around him. You're right. Swarm of flies, OP. <laughs> I wish we could like. I wonder if you can go underground here. You can maybe go down here. I think people go to this area, the the Siofra area at level like 60. You could try. I don't know what levels are appropriate for the underground. Do I feel any input lag when rolling? No, but also I've heard that people are like just finding out that roll happens on release of circle. And it's always happened on release of circle because you couldn't run if not. <laughs> I've had a couple people ask me that. Like if you if you tried to dodge roll with that with hitting circle instead of the release of it, you would never be able to run with circle. So that's always been a thing in Dark Souls. At least from all the games that have circle is running. There we go. But yeah, we can go down here. Hell yeah. So maybe you're just thinking you should be rolling when you hit it, but it's when you release it. Sometimes you can actually like hold circle for like a half second, then let go of it and you'll dodge. Kaza Matsuri. Where am I? This is not where I was standing. Oh yeah, I guess I could see the activity in the under map, couldn't I? I didn't even think about that. Where? Oh where? If they're up top, I swear. Yeah, you can crouch in R1. Well, you don't even have to instantly. If you're crouched and you are R1, you get the roll attack. So, that's pretty useful for the people that use ultras. They have like a good rolling attack. Yeah, if you hold it beyond that window, you'll just be running. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Cause that's how you run. That's because they have run and uh, roll bound to the same button. Oh my god. <laughs> what a sneak! <laughs> what are we sneaking to, brother? Where are we going? <laughs> I kind of like this guy. Oh, he's got a sneaky teammate over there. Anyone else gonna come out of the bushes? 
Anyone? Hey! Hey, <laughs> hey dude. Hey! <laughs> These are wholesome interactions. Um. Ah. Ah. Can give him a gift. Here. Can have one of my hard-earned souls. Yeah. But now I murder your phantom. We must murder. Wait. <laughs> Boiled prawn. Ah. Ah. Should I leave him hey. alone? Should I do this one kindness? I got good vibes. I don't know. Okay, they seem like they want to fight now. Let's do it. We've exchanged gifts. Yeah, hell yeah. Now we fight. The wizard fights. Oh, I wasted my juice. My poor juicies. What does that do? Oh, it's a fireball. Okay. My glinstone arc. Oh no. I forgot there was another one of ye. Oh boy. That does some of the bigger damage. Nice. I love these guys though. They were cool. They're very cool. <laughs> Low FP wizard. Listen. It's the quality of the magic. Not the amount. Okay. It's the quality of the hits. <laughs> Not the wizard spam. <laughs> that was pretty wholesome though. Oh, the bow shoots at the ground for AoE. Damn, I didn't know that. That is a good tip, Chaos. Thank you. Did not know that. And there goes someone. Someone died. Hi Q. Hey Q. <laughs> it's not the size, it's how you use exactly. Did no one tell you that? This place is really cool to invade though, damn. I didn't even think about coming down here. This is double the map, that's right. It's <laughs> funny. Try finger, but whole. Oh! I heard something behind me. It worried me. Hey, you! Masamoto kun. It's frost v frost, it seems. You know what else I have? I have what you have! <laughs> but I'm a wizard! I'll mark your grave. Can I hold that and keep firing it? <laughs> yeah, the, the compass shows you uh, the direction of the host at the very least. Oh, they're really instant down here too. There's a lot of people down here. Nice. Oh, uh, well you get an infinite one by doing the quest line of Vera. Uh, He's in the Rose Church in Lyernia. I'm trying to remember all the names of the areas. There's so many. I uh, know this is the Uchi Katana. I do have the Moon Veil. I just haven't been using it. Legends will tell of my small FP wizard. <laughs> it's okay. We hit really hard with the little amount of magic we can do. Whoa, that, that's the first frame loss I've seen in this game. That was weird. At least to that extent. Vare, not Vera. Sorry, Vare. Listen, I don't read. He called me maidenless. Everyone in the game calls us maidenless. So we secure one. Then they ain't got shit to say. Then they're all quiet.
Yeah, you can get one from the Volcano Manor as well. Sorry, I just I say the uh, the Vera one or the Vare one because it's closer to the beginning of the game. But yeah, you can get the Volcano Manor one, which is interesting. They have two fingers but no Wexta. So sad. Where are these guys? Jeez. Hello. Hey yo. What is this? What is this concoction? Squanto the Mighty. Hey! Yeah, 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 I see your ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm making friends with the sun, bro. You're not friendly. Young pizza. I will freeze you. Freeze you to death, little pizza. You wanted war. You got war. Uh. <laughs> These guys are interesting, to say the least. Oh, hell no. What? You dare? Your scarlet rot dragon? Dishonest, disgusting scarlet rot dragon. Okay. So I gotta keep a far distance from that guy, I guess, somewhat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh boy, that is quite the range you got yourself there, Dragon Lord. <laughs> it's one of the stronger things in the game for sure. Like, now that I'm close, he's probably gonna cast it. I gotta, like, prepare myself. I gotta, like, trade. Perfect. There goes Dragon Boy. I knew he was gonna cast it. That Dragon Flame was your undoing! Now it's just me and Young Pizza. I eat large pizzas for breakfast. Your toast, come here. Let me just roll right, Well, that is if you roll, I guess. I have one of those too. How do you feel about that, young pizza? Here, come trade this. Okay, you won that one. You won that one because I need more FP. That's that's the sole reason you, you gained any ground on me at all. Take that, my bug jutsu. How does it feel to get hit by a bug? Yeah, take that. And a little bit of this. And some more of that. And my wave of this. More. Have a little more. Running attack! Running attack! Stomp! FP. You know what he won't enjoy? Okay, I'm trying to two-hand my weapon here. No one enjoys this. Smack! Gonna try to incorporate the... Can't stop, won't stop! <laughs> that was pretty cool. That was a cool mix of spells. I'm kinda getting the hang of them. How they can possibly blend together. He's but a young pizza. This place is awesome. Damn, we should have. The R15 combo. <laughs> Oops. I meant to shake my sword. Those dragon spells are crazy though. You gotta really watch out. Like, I don't think you can outrun it when you when they cast it. Like once they start casting it, so it's definitely something that people can pull out to definitely kill you quickly in a team. If you're like aggressing them and then just randomly dragon roar, like you can't outrun it. You get stunned. It's rough. Nice chaos. Yeah, I haven't hit it yet. They've all seen me, I guess. I haven't had any of those kind of encounters yet. I think I put it away. I can maybe bring it back out though because I don't know. Some of these are good. I'm not really, I mean, I'm kind of using all of them, I guess. The hammer is really cool, but I have landed it a few times. <laughs> Indeed, I have landed it a few times. <laughs> I love it. 
Oh yes, let's see. Your arrow vest is mine. I've supercharged mine though. Yeah, terrible reaction time, sir. Much to learn, young wizard. Oh. Nice. I see we're very similar, you and I. Don't mind if I just hit you with the hammer of doom. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Job. Wizard on wizard violence. Blam! <laughs> it's so it's so satisfying. It's kind of slow, so people panic roll like twice and get hit the third time. Man, it does use like all my FP though, but it, it's worth it to get kills like that. That's so funny. <laughs> Definitely worth it. And I don't want to hear anything about my low FP. I want to hear nothing about that. <laughs> it's working, as you can see. Pretty funny though. Why don't you use curve swords? I could. I could. Um, I just don't have a ton of weapons upgraded. That's really it. I gotta. I gotta buy more uh, upgrade material on this character. Where am I? Oh. Yeah, you can. So if you're really close to them, Sele or Selethag, uh, you definitely uh, can hit them out of it. I guess it's when they're like close but not in range to hit that it becomes a problem I guess <laughs> I don't need FP wizards are just intelligent cleric with no fate <laughs> hey most of my kills are I've been really fun with my spells though you know it, it works I got I got the sword that does high damage we got the bonk hammer it's beautiful notice how they're both spell versions of a weapon though can we just <laughs> that's why I like them how much int? I have 36 right now. We're slowly leveling him as I go throughout the game. Well, he'll probably be like level 80 next time we use him. Hello there. You're a wiser, but reluctant. I am a wizard, but I'm a little reluctant. You're right, you're right. Yeah, take that. What well, nice aim chase. Only the absolute best aim for my wizard. That's right, your madness. Your rock madness pathetic. Trade this, wizard. Wow. He actually did. He did trade that. <laughs> I don't recommend it, but he did it. That took a lot of his health. Oh, I can poison straight side. That's right. Not too many hits of one, though. I think only one hit. That's good enough. We'll get him with the bonk, then. What's in his offhand now? Some madness seal. I'm a little confused. You should just keep the sword out and use the seal. Roll for your life, brother. This isn't a game. You're fighting for your life. Nice. You can roll catch with that. See, I had the perfect amount of FP. I ran out right at the end. I had exactly what I needed. <laughs> I haven't tried sleep yet. <laughs> Dylan's been on the, the hunt right now, banning all the webcam chat bots, which I'm very thankful for. <laughs> all the intelligence, but no brain power to use it. <laughs> Excuse me. I have 10 mind. It's fine. <laughs> I do have the stats to use Moonvale, yes. I have it on the character, but I just haven't been using it. I don't know what about my stream attracts webcam bots. Maybe it's all like the algorithm of me saying booty for like five years when I backstab someone. Like that's the only thing I can think about, to be honest. I have no idea why I get so many webcam bots like that. <laughs> I'm the only hot girl in here. Got the power, Dylan. <laughs> oh, I got fog walled. It's okay though. Oh, weird! It took me there. <laughs> they want me to join the show. Shit! It's my fallback plan. The streaming doesn't work out. 
That's that movie with Channing Tatum in it? I always forget. <laughs> uh, I forget. I forget. But I definitely seen it. Shit. Connection error. Sad. Healthy health wizard build. <laughs> yeah. Man, I had to make a choice. It was die in one or two hits or have a lot of FP flasks. And I weighed my options and the FP flasks seem more efficient. <laughs> Magic Mike, thank you. You would know, Chuck. You would know. <laughs> That's funny. All right. It's a boar. I haven't had a boss invasion, no. I have not. I'm a gizzard lizard, Harry. But my name is not Harry. It's Mary, no. Are you guys dragged into watching one? That's so weird, it should send you home, right? Just like Dark Souls 3, so that's funny. But then again, I've had that happen in Dark Souls 3, so... Oh no, they're waiting right by the Twin Horn. Let's see. Hey, boys! Oh. Luna, you scare me. Everyone starts with that bubble. You dare try to bleed me? I break your bubble! Dishonest bubble. Take my sword. Thrust it right in your rear. This guy's aggressive. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, that actually still hit me. Freaking ledges. Two for one. Nice. I stuck my katana through both of you at the same time. How did it feel? Probably not good, but that's fine. It felt good for me. Dodge. Maybe if I can cut the dodge close, I can roll it. Nope. Oh, I did roll it. It stunned me, but I rolled it. Nice actually pretty damn huge. Okay, they're, no, they're not getting caught by that. I might just use the sword. They're too hyper-aggressive for the wizardry. Unless I can get them with the glintstone sword. I need the bait one, though. Nice. That worked. Need more FP. You need to die, Luna. You are the thorn in my side. Goodbye, Stalavern. That was a fun fight, though. They pressured well, you know? They didn't give me too many openings. Ah, uh, yeah, so... I've been explaining that, like, when you dodge a stat proc in Dark Souls 3 Elden Ring, I don't know if it happened in Dark Souls 2 and 1, but they would still build up, so... You can dodge the actual status proc. It'll still stun you in this game, which is why like madness still procs and you get the stun. Um, but you, I think you dodge the damage. I'd have to rewatch my madness video to see if they got hurt from that, but I know it definitely stunned them. Pretty sure. Have I played around with menu tech? I'm scared for my muscle memory. No, it's the same. It's hey, honestly the same. Just wanted to Look. let you know you're an inspiration to a fellow invader here. Um, also, you can. Would it be a good idea to let us to level when respecting if we want? Um, I don't. I think that would make it too easy to for people to get everything fully upgraded and be a low level, and also that would be weird for the matchmaking because if you could just jump around at any soul level with any upgrade level weapon like that, you wouldn't find as much PVP. So there's like a progression to the game. You could beat the game at a low level, sacred. 
and make a PvP character for that, but the weapon level would definitely lock you out of online play in some areas because of that, because of the matchmaking. So I don't think it'd be the best idea, to be honest. If you want to make like a soul level like 80, 60, whatever for PvP for certain areas, you just gotta keep your weapon level right and beat the game like that. Because then they'd have to de-level weapons and that would just like, I don't know how they would do that for the matchmaking, to be honest. It would be weird. Uh, yeah, you can rebind your touchpad though. If you're on PC, Dylan. Ooh, are you, are you still on PlayStation? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> if you're on PlayStation, I don't have a fix for you. But on, on, on Steam, you can rebind whatever button you want, right? Because it's uh, your controller. So my, my start button's still... Like, everything's still the same for me. Ah, uh, level 80? I'd say everyone's been saying that, like... What was it? Somber 5 or 6 is good, which is the equivalent of 12 or 15. Um, yeah, I know Solace, I know. It's always been like that. You can never D-level like that. Uh, this is the best Souls game, for sure. I mean, the combat's there. The open world is amazing. The boss fights are sick. Uh, the PvP is a little different, which is taking me some getting used to, because it uses, like, uh, the active poise instead of Dark Souls 3's hyper armor, which I'm a little biased to. I prefer hyper armor and true combos, but they do it different here, so I've been adjusting and getting used to it. Filthy low FP non-wizard. I just dabbled at the beginning of the school, Revy. I, I, I got the magic quick, and I got Thank out. You. Filthy low FP non-wizard. <laughs> 75 plus 6 plus 16. Okay, that's a good guess that I had then. So like 16, 15, 6. That, that makes sense. What about the lore, Chase? Oh, the lore? Hmm, well this one's all about the fingers, you know, so... <laughs> oh, you sneaky mother brothers! Hey, this is gonna work against you. I got an ice stomp. Sneaky fucks. Where'd they go? Wow. Wow. <laughs> you guys had the best ambush ever and you didn't even hit me. Well, you did, but you barely hit me. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, I told you. Nice. Good job. I think that's what they wanted me to do. <laughs> you died to your own trap. Filthy wizard. I'm a clean wizard. I deserve the win. It's one of those coups. <laughs> Coup d'etats. That's funny. Revy, thank you though for the membership. <laughs> that was really funny though. As if they camped that waiting for me. That's crazy, honestly. Get out of here, crap. I'll kill you. I just don't know if I waste FP here if I waste it in the invasion as well, so I don't want to. They didn't use the high ground. <laughs> well, I, I feel like a lot, like what a lot of people are saying, like everything I've used so far, everyone just calls OP, but like everything's OP in this game. You can't like go an inch without finding something that does really high damage. Like people are saying bleeds OP, uh, everything's OP. That's really it. There are some things stronger than others, but the game isn't fully balanced yet. You're going to find some crazy shit. Like... There's tons of things that are OP. There's a scythe that makes it so you can't heal, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, I could throw on that scythe on whatever build, hit them with a the weapon art, they can't use the Restus. Like, that's pretty damn strong! Uh, ice procs are strong. Horfrost is strong. The Ajula's Moonblade can one-shot, like, with their low health. Like, there's just so much that's so strong right now. But Moonveil is strong. Uh, I'm trying to think. People were calling the Rivers of Blood I was using OP, and it didn't even have scaling. I was just very good at roll catching and getting bleed procs. Like, you know what's better? Two katanas blood infused. They will get you better bleed procs than the not working Rivers of Blood. Like, everything is strong in this, and you can't compare it to Dark Souls 3. You just can't. It's not the same. It's not balanced like that. They have work to do. You need to stop coming into this mindset with, like, your melee sword is going to do, like, one-tenth of someone's health. No, no. Things can two-shot you, and it's scary. <laughs> It is scary. <laughs> I found I fought a wizard the other day that 
What did they even hit me with? This Moonlight Sword. And it did 80% of my health. I got invaded by a guy that used the scythe. I was like, hmm, that's a bit OP. And it still does a lot of damage. Yeah, Ash, there's, there's just so much in this game right now that's OP. So it's like, I'm not going to avoid using every weapon in Ash of War that's decent or good just because it's strong. You know what I mean? Like, I'm going to be fighting against it too. So why would I not use it? Although there is some glitches that I'm not going to use, like that curse buildup AOE. That's just fucking crazy. Thank you. The curse buildup thing is ridiculous. I won't do that. That's that's nuts. Uh, what's the best class uh, to start with in Elden Ring as a beginner in Souls games? Um, I honestly think I would say the Vagabond because its its stat buildup is good. You have decent armor from the the armor set. You have a sword and shield to learn how to block and do the counter attacks in PVE. Um, yeah. Yeah, like everything is very, there's lots of very strong things. So it's like, it's hard to say what's the best. Obviously the, the weird glitch with the shield that's a machine gun and the weird glitch with the shield that has curse buildup. That's dumb. <laughs> you know, that's obviously not intended and that's very powerful. And then the next tier, you know, I might put Moon Veil up there with its high damage, it's fast. The stomp you can dodge. It is very strong though. I'm not going to say it's not. The stomp is fucking strong as hell. It's been helping a lot today, uh, but you can wait for it to cross you and then dodge the actual ice breaking and you will not take like any damage so there's ways to dodge it and people have been dodging it pretty well like bleed buildup is strong you know there's lots you just gotta have fun with it not worry so much about the balance yet because it's brand new when you get too angry about that stuff it's not gonna help you at all you just gotta have fun with it Wah! Like, look, if I do this, 30 damage, he didn't dodge. They both stood on it. If they would have just waited for the wave of ice to come, they could have dodged it. Death aura with machine gun shield thanks are all the way to medicus levels. Woo! I already fought a, a death machine shield uh, at level 70 the other day, I think. It was pretty interesting. I just I just waited out by dodging, and then I went for the uh, kill before he could buff it again. To be honest though, I think I do the best with like melee weapons. I can roll catch so well in Souls games, like I just know they're gonna panic roll. And they could jump it. Like I think people just it is very wide range though, it's a strong AoE, I'm not saying it's not definitely great. But you can dodge it. The curse build up and the other things, not really. You can't I mean you gotta run away from those. Oh, <laughs> that's weird. I'm out of FP as well. Yeah, I've tried the Moon Veil. I haven't been using it today a lot because it's really strong. That's all. Also, always going to be strong as a wizard. That's homing soul mass, but stronger. Oh. Oh, nice fight, uh, Qualcara. Nice fight. Yeah, yeah, exactly, Blue. They're ridiculous. That's why you run away from them, right? It's, it's stupid. For sure. For sure. That's what I'm saying. Like, the game's just not, like, fully balanced right now. You just gotta have fun with it. Enjoy it. There's gonna be some OP shit. I'm not taking it too seriously. Did I change my controls to be able to look around? No, I just I just hold circle with my index finger and then I use the uh, the analog. Yeah, it's basically a frost. Well, it's a frostbite mage. The bleed is just there because I'm using a katana. Uh, I, so I'm weird. I claw grip when I run to move the camera, but then when I'm actually fighting, I don't do that. And I do this other weird thing where I use my index finger to hit start. <laughs> I don't know. I like rotate my hand. Yeah, there's a few things that are just a little bit too OP like that. You'll run into them from time to time. <laughs> yeah, the, the sword of night and flame can be rough.
Yeah, this game has so much more to it than Dark Souls 3, for sure. That's why it's kind of cool, you know? You never know what you're going to run into. Gravity magic's pretty cool. It is. It is. I hit R1 with my toe. My keyboard is there for a uh, jump. I just use my, my toes to jump on a keyboard. Not going to lie, that'd be pretty optimal. <laughs> I just thought about that, but no, I don't do that. I'm joking. I do not do that. What the heck? Oh, is that the cannon of Hyman? Oh, it's the arrow! Oh, hey, dude. You coward! Wait a second. That doesn't cost FP to charge up? Wow! <laughs> Damn it! I thought they had gone the smart route with that. Damn it! That's rather powerful. Because you can apply pressure like that. That's the carrion piercer, right? Or is that carrion slicer? I don't know. Oh, that guy does not. See, that's a normal mage. I'm the opposite of a normal mage. Nice. The frostbite couldn't have procced at a better time. Ah, damn. Nice. <laughs> that was a why at 400 HP. That is a normal wizard right there. We're the we're the low FP healthy wizard. We're a different breed, us. <laughs> we're a much different breed for sure. Um, I don't think I did all quest lines on my first playthrough. Can you do all quest lines and not have them interfere with each other? I'm not sure. I'm honestly not sure on that one. Kya. Sure, yeah. Wizard, wizard life. Uh, that's always been a thing, Robert, yeah. It's one of the more annoying things from Dark Souls 3, because you'd be... Uh, there was a six player limit in Dark Souls 3 and there you would have four on the, the host side and then two invaders and you guys can hit each other. So that's, it's always been a thing. I guess I'm used to it. Nice, Chris. Let's go. This this cape just works so well with this hat. Like, it's it's perfect. If, if I could only have the cape be blue, not red, it would be perfect. 10 out of 10. Oh, can it? It can only be rolled out of when you fully charge it. I guess I didn't notice right there. This way? Oh, wait. Are they up there again? Kind of seems like it. Well, someone's up there, at the very least. It's a hilarity when I get invaded by two. Most of the time, they end up killing each other. Yeah, because... I guess there's a lot of AOE spells in this, and they definitely hit each other constantly. I bet, I bet. I haven't found too many co-invaders. But now that I think about it, the few times that I did, I did hit my teammate. I didn't kill him, but I hit him. <laughs> I definitely hit him. Are they up here? They are up here. I don't think he noticed me. <laughs> I want to surprise him. Ah, shit, he just progressed. Damn it. <laughs> I thought he was going to try to like attack me around the corner like the last team did. That was funny. My co-invader blasted me with the Kamehameha. Yeah, that'll happen. Wait. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just, I just know that scared the living shit out of him. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. Sometimes we're evil. We are a wizard. It's allowed. It's part of the outfit. <laughs> that one felt kind of bad. He didn't have a teammate. How do you roll catch? You just kind of adjust to the latency. I, I played Dark Souls 3 for like five years. You definitely get used to it. It's hard though. Comes with the job, I guess that's true. <laughs> I've had some surprise backstabs on me, I'm not gonna lie. They're pretty hilarious. You don't expect it because like they're so rare in this game. Uh, I'm level 60 actually, Robert. Going to level 70 soon. We're gonna level him up. Um, just so I can invade the Liurnia as a wizard. I just wanted to be part of the wizard castle, to be honest. But then we also found out that level 60 is really good for this area, here. Different areas are going to have like higher activity at different levels, because that's when people go to them, I guess. Same as Dark Souls, really. Although it's more vague here, because it's an open world. Create builds? You, I, I just run my one character that's medium level through the game and then I go collect the weapons that I want and then I use the larval tier to reallocate. Well, because you could say my HP is the highest stat I have. <laughs> that's how my HP is high. I'm a wizard with no mind. <laughs> it's working though. I, you know, I'm not opposed to it. <laughs> it's been working. Hello. Oops, that's not- man, I'm so used to my gestures being on my select button. Oriana, hello. Yeah, I want to invade Kaelid, but I, I don't know what uh, like level to be for Kaelid, to be honest. Hey, you're a frost user as well. Welcome to the crowd. I have one of these. So you can just dodge it, it's not, it's not too bad. You take a little bit of frostbite damage, but at the same time, well, we like the same build. Or you can just strafe it, I guess. Like it's, if you know it's coming, it's not too bad at all. It's just when people like panic and run and back away from it or whatever that the ability becomes strong. It does a lot of damage though. Don't get me wrong. It's just as you can see, I, I barely got hit by it. There. Jesus, way to jump me, buddy. Fun fight, Alani. Oh. <laughs> level 70 got me instant in Kaelid? Okay. So the 70 80 range, I guess. What weapon level there? I'll make my dual wield build for next stream at that level. I want to try like a few weapons that are good. Maybe either strength or dex and dual wield. So maybe level 70 or 80 for Kaelid. 110 is too high for Caleb. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. That's like end end game, sort of. Woo! Hello, thickens. He's thick. Okay, we not we want to get not zoned here. Julio, Tulio and Miguel, Miguel and Tulio. Wow, that's a strong shield. Holy buddy. Oh, that guy's fat rolling. Oh, I put an R1 right there. What in the hell? Sometimes I swear the game misses inputs. The shield guy's just like existing. <laughs> oh, I wish I could backstab that easier. Oh 
blood loss and a mix of all that. That's dangerous. Cover. Oh, see, sometimes you can't like move forward when you jump. It's very strange. Hello, Jay. I'm back. That's interesting, but it doesn't go as long as you'd expect it to go. Nice! Honestly surprised, because his connection wasn't the best. Yeah, I aren't used to the parkour yet. This rock is my, my pressure. This guy's tough, because he's got the defense. And then the host has the bleed. Ah, bleed dust stun, okay. Oh, that's death. GG, oof. <laughs> it's a good mix when you have some of the DPS and the axe. It definitely does a high amount of damage. Oof. So yeah, the, the bleed does stun for sure. Uh, Kaelid has a broad range on PS5. Yeah, I, I bet you it's going to be similar ranges though for PS5 and PC. <laughs> Too bad we don't have tears of denial in this, I know. Uh, I don't think Arcane and... Mm, I haven't actually leveled Arcane while using Madness, so I'm not sure. I don't think so, because the weapon scales off Faith, but I don't know. Anyone in chat? Uh, have you tried using an Arcane build with Madness? I haven't, so I can't help you with that. Uh, well, I think there's like a, a flask tier. Someone told me there's like a flask tier of denial. Which is super useful. Yeah, well, I mean, I think there's a, or a an Ash of War that looks like it guard breaks, but I don't know how good it is. That looks interesting. Is that a cannon? That is indeed a cannon. We have not seen that. Oh, there's a Flask Tears. Which one is it? I definitely want to look into that. That'd be nice. But it wears off when the Flask wears off, correct? I would assume. This guy doesn't look like he knows how to dodge, so... Well, let's get him with a little bit of that. Oh, uh, the guy came down. This is not good. Oh, we can jump here. That's not very high. Okay. Nice. I thought it was like if I jump off, I die height. Alright, we need our FP flask now. Oop. I want to get the cannon. I mean, not the cannon. I want to. Oh, there's a blue coming in. Oh, God. Hold up. We need to spread them out a little bit. That's a bleed spell, I believe. Yes, walk right near this, Mr. Blue. Perfect. Perfect. That's exactly what I was using that for. <laughs> Get deeped. Oh, that's a tree. <laughs> you got caught on the tree. <laughs> Feel my pain! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I didn't even think about using that earlier. That's so funny. Okay, what's the best? This one. Oh, go get him! Wizard Blast! <laughs> that poor blue. Oh, that's pain. <laughs> Oh, that's actually painful. <laughs> Lightning ballsy. Oh my god. This area's pretty cool, honestly. Um, I don't think we'll get any here, though. Let's go back to the school a little bit, just because we are a wizard. It's so fitting. It tends to be three-man teams in here, too.
Oh yeah, I'm definitely calling this as game of the year, 100%. It's so fun. <laughs> Feels bad, man. Feels bad. Lightning Ball Z. Nice. Oh, no, I have build ideas, lots of them, uh, but I have to make them. <laughs> that takes the time. So I've been doing the invasion streams, and then the next day I'll take some time at my own like leisure to run through the parts that I need for the build. Plus, I gotta look at the weapons, read them, like, you know, kind of decide on what I want to use. There's so much. Um, 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 there, this way. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna get those FP talismans for this wizard when we return to wizarding, but I think next build. Probably dual wielding of some kind, some melee thing. Poop shark build. <laughs> Regen faith in like a po Oh, in the Scarlet Rot area. Ooh. That's a little bit too strong of damage. Wait. Huh? Okay. That's weird. Crimson Bubble Tear. I'm pretty sure I have that. Oh, it says restores HP when near death. Maybe I don't have that. Right now I'm lost. Pretty sure I can't go that way either. Hmm. Yeah, I think they're above the boss room. Can I access that right now though from where I am? Uh. I don't know if I can. With that fog wall in the way. Yeah, maybe I can go around, but I'm pretty sure they don't have the shortcut open either. I'll go check them. Okay, and the fog wall doesn't impede it. Alright, let's go. We go. Oh yeah, I guess I can go over here. Pretty sure they didn't have this open though. I've already been here. Oh, the the shortcut on the right. I don't. They must have it open. I hope they do. Yikes! I don't know if they do though. Oh, they do. They do. No, they don't. Uh, the other way is fogged walled off, though. I guess I can try to use the fingers again. I don't know why they have some of the areas fogged off like that. It's weird. They should just have it all opened. Rip. This isn't where I want it to be. Seems like they're moving though. No, they're not moving. They're right there. <laughs> East side of the boss room. Um, we can't go in the boss room though. If you go to the left of the fog wall, there's a shortcut. I mean, the fog wall is like beside a wall. I'll look though. I'll look. I guess I'm not just. I'm not sure of what you're talking about. So up here, you mean? And then here, right? But see, the, the issue is the fog walls there. Oh, they jumped down. Fuck it. It's okay. But like, look here. I'll show you what I mean. Fog wall. I see them though, I see them, I see them. <laughs> hey boys! You think Moonvale will carry you? It might. Lag is strong with this wizard. Sean, come, come to the turtle. I think this guy's only done the weapon art. There are other moves, young one. That's gonna hit you both. <laughs> well, I guess I hit one of them. That's good enough. 
Nice. I like ticking at them. The Coon Veil. That's gonna hurt. Oh, damn, damn, damn. Jesus. Those comboed. <laughs> That was not what I was expecting. Battle of the Annoying Weapon Arts. Sean has never experienced roll catch before. It's your turn, Thraxus. Oh, you dodge a little bit better. <laughs> the onion helmet's cute. What? I used the onion helmet for a little bit. It has really good absorption, and it looks pretty good. It looks half, not half bad. I'm having a blast with it, G59, but Dark Souls 3 is definitely more balanced PvP for sure. Uh, they, they'll be working on this for a while, I assume. They're constantly doing updates, I see. Like, at least the networking right now. I'm sure they'll try things. I hope. <laughs> onion. Thought it was a pumpkin. It is a pumpkin. I'm sorry. <laughs> the onion helm is from Dark Souls. It looks the same, but it's like an onion. <laughs> this one's a pumpkin. You're right. You're totally right. Yeah, this actually is a good way to enter a fight. Nice. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> this actually is a good way to enter the fight. Instant crit. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> Sometimes that's funny. Don't hold your shield up to that magic. That magic is a doozy. <laughs> nice to see that start is as effective as ever. Yep. It still works as a mage. For sure. I definitely have to look through all the Ashes of War though. We gotta try some out. We've been a lot of uh, builds that have their own unique weapon art. You know, we gotta, we gotta see what we can do with the Ashes of War. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Um, oh, they have this unlocked, but the issue is... Oh, they're there. Hey, boys. Let's get this going. I gotta use this more. It's actually really good. I wonder if I can combine it with my Horfrost Stomp. That sounded so funny. Oh, that's cool. I haven't seen that one before. I like that. I've seen that one. In fact, I have that one. I wonder if he knows that he can't aim this at me. Oh. I can just walk and dodge that. That would have been the time for him to use that. Haha! <laughs> Baited. It ain't over yet. We're either gonna use the hammer or we're gonna use the frost blade. Oh, nice! That was a good roll catch, actually. Oh, I didn't know I was gonna break him there. Holy shit, this guy's a, a freaking stage hazard. This guy just lagged right as he hit me. Buddy! <laughs> oh my god! The hell! The hell! That man did not move. He was a stationary stage hazard. <laughs> what the hell? 
No wonder he can. You know, you know what? To be fair, if you switch my health bar and his FP bar, we're the same build. He just he specked into pew 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 pew, <laughs> and I like being able to take the pews. <laughs> funny well, I'm a wizard it's a rare wizard indeed <laughs> although if, I don't know if I want to showcase my wizard I don't want to run into healthy wizards that sounds like a bad time <laughs> continue to go with your high DPS little wizards I, I promise it's better I promise I promise I, I just don't follow my wizardry <laughs> Yeah, the frostbite is really cool, actually. Whee! Whee! Wait, you know, every time I invade here, I feel like they're always in that spot. Wait. Where are they, actually? I don't have a compass right now. This is weird. Oh, you go like, yeah, yeah, you go in for the weapons. Yeah, that's usually what I do. What the hell? This is so strange. Do you think they like lagged out or something? Cause... Oh. Why did it suddenly appear? Oh, they're there, hello. Uh, that's it, me and you wizard off. Wait, hang on, wait, wait, wait. You have more wizard juice? I need more wizard juice, it's only fair. How's it feel, bing bombs? How's it feel? You enjoying it? Are you feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? <laughs> Are you feeling it now? That's right, have fun with this. Oh, now you want a sword battle, huh? Now you're all about the sword game. <laughs> wow, I actually got a frostbite proc right then. That was so funny. That's what you get. You get your spam right back at you. <laughs> that was a Harry Potter off right there. <laughs> oh, that's too fun, man. It's actually funny. I don't mind wizard on wizard battles. They're pretty funny. <laughs> Thoughts on a, a blight build? Ah, uh, yeah, I won't be doing it just because I like actually fighting. <laughs> That's it's just cheesy. And people will hate you. <laughs> uh, mage equivalent of the straight sword R1 spam. True, it's just L1. It's just the one different button, you know? It's not that, it's not that big of a deal. Actually, I want to go more in the tunnel of this area. Where is that schoolhouse? Yeah, I love fighting in that corridor. It's so cool. I'm level 230 and now and PvP is dead, of course. <laughs> no, we don't. A, a lot of people have come in here and uh, asked that. And it's because like not everybody plays it as much as us that like love the Soul series. You know, they all are enjoying the game. But they're probably playing it a couple hours a day. Versus those of us that have like beat the game and are like high level on our main characters. Um, no, we don't smoke. I would say anywhere from like 60 to 80 would be great. I've been enjoying 60 a lot. 50 is good as well. Like 50 to 80. I stopped at 135. Yeah, my main is 135 and I still couldn't find invasions on him. At least not around the map, so. We have work, exactly. Like, more people are definitely the range that I'm in right now to 100. 100 is probably active, probably. I can't say for, certain see, uh, for certainty because I haven't done it. I'm gonna go like 70 or 80 next stream and then build up that way I'm hitting all the areas that everyone who's playing is hitting, you know what I mean? Um, reached 1000 yesterday, well you're all alone. Oh my god, that wizard's fast. 
<laughs> requesting time off. That's true dedication, Drift. See? Everyone loves. Alright, here we go. Excuse you. Hammer bros. No. <laughs> yeah, it still hit him. Nice. Aw, oh, there's a blue. Damn, I should have waited. That's got some cool armor. Uh, yeah. So far, I have three characters. Uh, Ral Ralvane. Yeah, basically, I let my main sit at 130, and I'm just waiting for it to be like where everybody's at. And I'm, I'm gonna do. I have my 60s made, a 50 made, and then I'm gonna make an 80, so I can have like all the ranges that are active for now. Anyway, maybe 100 as well. Uh, well, blues are always like that, eternal, even on Dark Souls 3 when it is super active. Yeah, like, call it, like, people have to be wearing the blue covenant thing for one. Not parry, I, I don't think there's any quick buffs. There's only the greases, and there's not enough time to do that, sadly. David. <laughs> I looked at those, unless I'm missing a quick buff that I haven't seen. Yeah, I feel like being a phantom is a good way to uh, grind and get a lot of the items as well. You can get the larval tiers, I guess, from being a phantom, I've heard. I haven't actually used the blue summon sign, to be honest. I guess I could have in my playthrough. I didn't think to do that. Drawstring grease? Is that like a faster one? I never used it. We're still all noobs. <laughs> we don't know the ways of everything yet. At least I don't know all the items. Um... Try the academy a little bit. Yeah, at least the armor swaps are possible. I don't know if you can buff. Nice. Yeah, I think I'm gonna stick to the Caleb area when we do 70 tomorrow, since we've done two days of like Liurnia, and we did the Al Altus Plateau a lot with the uh, Madness build with Liurnia. Um, I'll stick to like Caleb next stream as a level like 70 or 80, I guess. Whatever you guys think is more popular there, I'll do. Oh, the drawstring grease is the equivalent of the bundles. Okay, so there are some. It's cool. I didn't know that. I Yeah, dude. Ty. Okay, I'm not the only one. I also thought the drawstring grease was for bows. <laughs> I mean... Dude, how is it not for bows? Why would you name it that? That's so funny. I thought it was some like arrow buff. I didn't read though. I suppose I could have read and it would have been better. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay, as long as I wasn't the only one thinking that, it's okay. Yeah, bundles in Dark Souls 3 only lasted like 15 seconds. They were supposed to. Parkour City. I saw Lost Invading there. I definitely want to try that next stream. We're going to do some type of physical build for Kaled. Just want to finish up at least a couple more invasions here. Although we're not finding any now. I feel like we've we've murdered. We've murdered a lot. <laughs> Foot of the Four Belfries maybe? The Converted Tower we could try? Honestly, I think it'll still be like 120 to 150. It's whatever. I've never really cared. <laughs> I just go by wherever people are. I can manage my build at whatever soul level. Obviously not super low level. I hate anything below 60 for build making. It's so hard. You're like limited. Yeah, you can see the multiplayer status. Okay, Rodan Catacombs. Okay, so there are some of the Great Belfries. That's where I went earlier. Didn't find any though. Yeah, I gotta use the map more. I keep forgetting it exists. I keep forgetting every time. Y 
You ran into a hacker? Damn, dude. I haven't seen a real cheater. Thank God. Uh, well, I have mine at 1.30 currently, like my first playthrough one. I stopped there just in case, but uh, yeah, my guess is like between 1.30 and 1.50, I guess, from what everyone else is saying. Seems to be what people want anyway. Your shoes are clunky. I know. Listen, it's hard to match the fit, okay? <laughs> They're really wide toes. I don't know. I got to look at all the armor sets in the game and then make a fashion that I like a lot. I like this chest piece, though. Definitely one of my favorites so far. He was flying. <laughs> well, yeah, that's definitely a cheater. Unless you know, I've had some guy glide away off the map into the void, but I think it was more of like a connection issue. Oh, 150. Yeah, I haven't really tried this off. Okay, we're going to go back here, I guess. Jeez. Did they fix the rivers of blood scaling? Not yet. I don't think there's been an update yet. The clean knot set looks good. I'll have to look. Man, there's like, yeah, everyone's just offline now. <laughs> carrion knight armor is cool. It is. I do like the carrion set. It looks fine. I thought this one worked really well with my wizard, though. Weapon wouldn't really matter. Yeah, well, the weapon level matters. But yeah, Wex Dust is so nice in Dark Souls 3. I hope they add something like that to this for the DLCs or something. Instead of having to look in the area, it just looks for your level and looks around. Very pretty here, though. Wait, what? Wait. Oh my god! It's steam maintenance right now? What? Oh my god. <laughs> no wonder I haven't found an invasion for freaking 10 minutes, dude. Wow. I was like, there's no way there's no invasions right now. This is ridiculous. That is some baloney. I forgot today was Tuesday. Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> Fucking Tuesday, man. Bruh. That is why, yeah, when Steam goes on their maintenance on Tuesday, every Tuesday at around 7 p.m. my time. I forgot it was Tuesday. God damn it. This one's been lasting kind of long, though. I guess usually I've, I've end my stream before then just to be not caught up in the Steam maintenance. Which is some cheeks. I don't know how long this is going to be though, to be honest. Maybe we'll maybe we'll pause there for the day and I'll fix up the next build. Steam is not respecting. It usually only lasts like a half hour, but like, hey. Last five minutes? Yeah, but it's been like 10. <laughs> it, it really depends, I think, how long the maintenance is. Let me see. If I look at the actual Steam itself. Yeah, Steam's offline for, yeah. <laughs> well, you know what? That was like, what, four and a bit hours of invasions on our wizard? We'll give it five more minutes, and then we'll, we'll finish off with like an invasion or two. I don't want to end without a fight. I do want food, but like I want a few more fights. <laughs> Have you tried Loretta's War Sick? Here, actually, in the meantime, I can just kind of look at the weapons that are... You guys are talking about? Because I don't think I know. Of oh, Loretta's War Sick is a, is a Dexan weapon. I guess I could have used that on this as well. Elden Ring weapons. Oh, Steam just came back online. Mine didn't yet, but I will. It'll, it'll invade probably when it comes back. Whew. Okay. What weapons did you guys find interesting? I, I, I can either do... I don't know. Dual spears could be fun. Dual katanas could be fun. Um, I think I can do the light weaponry easier first before we do some big chonk boys. Uh, yeah, it comes off. It comes online in regions. I find so if it, if it's online for you, it'll be online for all. Yeah, mine's online now. There you go. We're good. I'll put the sign back then. Dual rapiers. We could do that too. That's true. That's true. Okay, back to my school ground then. I wanted to fight in that hallway. Freaking steam, bro. Way to do me dirty. 
Way to do me dirty. Black knife hood, fingerprint chest piece with a cloak, blaze gauntlets, and black knife legs. I'm trying to remember what the black knife hood looks like. Oh, uh, real. I gotta look. Although, if, it, if it's the NPC you fight, like the boss, yeah, his armor looked pretty sick. I can't deny. I thought that looked pretty good. Oh, is the, wait, the Dragon Lord Crag Blade. Is that the one with the lava? I actually saw that. It looked cool. For a second, I was going to use that in my playthrough when I was going through. But. Oh, uh, yeah, you can do the 1.5 times strength thing. Uh, cool, cool whip. Because I didn't have the strength for one of the weapons I was using. And I two-handed it, and it worked perfectly. So, I think that still exists. I think you're good. I think you're chilling. Nice. Feels good to be in an invasion. Down here? Around here? <laughs> Somewhere? Ah, hello, wizard friends. We'll make them think we're the average wizard. Nice. Yeah, we got a chunky, uh, oh, he's a wizard too. Ha <laughs> ha. Nice. They think I have weak magic, and then BAM! Ha 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 ha. Taste my wave. Nice. <laughs> you make them think you only got tiny pews, then you hit them with the big pews. <laughs> Ice is beautiful. All right, you have a good night, Dylan. <laughs> Enjoy your night, man. Thanks for stopping by, homie. The DN meta. Why am I blanking on the, the DN? <laughs> DN. Dual Naginatas. Nagakibas. <laughs> He's nuts. The <laughs> children. <laughs> oh, hey. Taste my wave blade. We get to fire three of those. No. That hit him. I have the reaction time of a grandma. Um, oh, I can't fire three? I could have sworn I did before. Hey, you want to use those? I got some of those. There you go. I'm kind of out of pews. We can do one tiny more pew and then we'll re redo our, our heals. Oh, I thought that was a dude. Alright, we gotta scare them. The wizard is to the left. There's the wizard. Found him. Wizard down. You dare fight my hammer? Fine. You get the beautiful hammer death. <laughs> Wizard battle. <laughs> I love that hammer so much. <laughs> Such a fun time, actually. It is silly fun currently. There's so much we don't know that it's just all random, you know? Gave him the Baja Blast Bonk. <laughs> True. Got that, like, Aqua Gatorade, you know? There we go. Do a Rune Arcs temp increase HP or uh, perma until you're dead? But you need a great rune attached, and you can't do it as an invader, so only a host can do that. Except for the Moog's great room, but it doesn't give you, like, health and stuff. So, uh, you have to do Ronnie's quest line, Big Draco. You must do the Ronnie quest line. Yeah, there's a lot of unbalanced stuff for sure, Jack. It's just, you just gotta have fun with it, you know? <laughs> you think? 
things we didn't see him. Oh! I didn't even know there was one behind me. Did we hit Emma? I think we did. Hey, Emmy. That's for you. <laughs> I dodge your bleed. Pebble. Stuns me. Didn't stun me, he'd be chilling. Oh my god, he didn't stop. So weird. Very unlike any team. So you can blood loss, dodge the blood loss. Okay, just battle of the weapon arts, I guess. <laughs> blood versus ice. That was weird. It's always a tunnel. Alright. <laughs> now it's me and you, and I want my wizard juice. my blue juice and then I will be back to murder you with my sword. <laughs> That's what you get the nut lord. You get a jeweler's moon blade and it does like 800 damage. That works well. You're a wizard Harry. A wizard. I don't know. I've tried three builds. They're all good in their own ways. The mage is cool. I'm squishier, but I uh, I do high damage with my mage abilities. Um, the bleed would have worked better if the sword scaling wasn't broken, so uh, that nerfed it a little bit, but we still performed so well with it. So, um, And then the madness build was probably the strongest thing so far, just because I'm really good at roll catching with the great war spear. I paired that with madness, and like the spells were pretty damn good. Uh, it was overall... A really good build just because madness is so strong right now have i play have i tried placida saxes the the double the, the breath roar i haven't i have not no <laughs> i know floyd i'm a filthy wizard i had to cover it though because people like wizards you know i had to become a wizard for the wizard lovers out there This is always a weird spawn point. There we go. Um, I, I wonder if I could jump in there. If I jump in there, I think I'm stuck. But, like, I swear I can go in there. I'm not going to go in there, but... Okay, while I'm up here, how the hell do you get up here the normal way? Interesting. Yeah, jump attacks have been weird overall. Um, that window, the doorway that I came in, you mean? I just wanted to like know how to get up here, but out the front door and to the right. Ah, but like I meant like if I jump down there, I'm stuck in there right now because like invasion fog wall, you know what I mean? I'm going to go out, but it's weird that I can go in here. Roof jumping? Ah, yeah. So weird. Okay. Where are they? They could be anywhere, though. Oh, they're on there. No, no. Oh, my God. They're in the ball area. Please. Please fight there. Oh, my God. It's so fun.
Oh, 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 good play, son, bro. I thought I had iframes on jumps. <laughs> no. <laughs> he batted me off my jump. That is so sad. <laughs> Rip. That's what I get for the ball fun, though. That's funny. I think all my deaths today have been gravity deaths. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> I didn't think he'd have time to jump in and get over there. I should have just waited. You do have iframes, just not at that moment. Okay, is it closer to the beginning of the jump or the end of the jump? I need to learn the ways of the jump. Well, no, if there's iframes, you can dodge anything. But I guess it's more at the beginning of the jump, huh? Not the end. That was funny. Uh, Thiago, yeah, no problem, man. There you go. I actually want to try dodging. Let's see. Let's, let's get an enemy while we wait to be invaded, and we'll just try to jump dodge. Maybe not this thing, but we can try. Hmm. Damn, that was too late. <laughs> Can we jump dodge everything, or...? Oh. Hmm. Oh, why was it running so bad? I'm trying to, like, figure out if jumping can be used to dodge easily. No, oh, see, you caught me mid-jump right there. Hmm. Yeah, that was a glitch that was happening with the game. It wasn't utilizing their GPUs. I heard about that. I guess, like, I don't know, it's not the same. Maybe this enemy isn't the best judge test here. Nope. Hmm, maybe it has to be, like, very tight for the jump frames. It's more like if you could jump out of the box, you won't get hit. Yeah, it doesn't give you, like, dodge high frames, I guess, huh? Obviously not the same as, like, a dodge, but... I, like jump away I guess that's normal though I guess okay works for ground attacks best that makes sense that makes sense uh yeah it deals for frostbite and bleed uh it might be steam again uh damn no wait no I think steam's okay steam went down for a second we're good though. There we go. Do by do I don't know. Do back steps have iframes? I haven't done it because Dark Souls Three trained me to not do that. You know what I mean? That also makes sense. But still, uh, I think I'll dodge more than I jump. To be honest. Zoro. I'm coming, Zoro. Hello? Oh my god. He's a samurai. Wizards have long range. It's part of our, our thing. Kya. I'm a wizard, Harry. Blood slash. Blood slash. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> That was a cool little fight, though. They're just as bad as Dark Souls, the back steps. All right, good to know. <laughs> we won't be backstepping that often, then, that's for sure. Katanas. <laughs> I don't, there's a lot better weapons than katanas, but that that blood it's more like the weapon arts than the weapons themselves at all. The weapon arts are just meta. <laughs> oh you just reallocate uh X with the with the larval tier.
But if you move, well, you could dodge like based on space, but I guess it doesn't give you like iframes like a roll, right? So I'm bad at the game and need a huge health bar. That's fair. Health is important. Health is important for all of us. Uh, okay, so they're out here. That's good. The Witcher! Ooh! That might hit me. Maybe not. Toss a coin to your Witcher. Oh, there's a blue behind me. A blue boy behind me. Oh, boy. Okay. We got away from the range of the blue boy. Storm. Storm. What? No! <laughs> the blue is about to die. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Although, yeah, the only the only sad thing is that I think we've had like three or four connection errors today, right? That's not bad for like what four and a half hours. That's not terrible, I guess. Uh, Lord Dusty, what's weapon, what's weapon level? Also, would a somber 2 be 4 regular? No, it's like closer to a 5. It's closer to a 5. It's like 2.5. It's very weird. It happens to you all the time. Yeah, it hasn't happened that much to me, but it's definitely happened like 4-ish times this stream. It's unfortunate. <laughs> I don't I don't think that was like a plug pull. I think that was a weird disconnect from them. Nero. Let's see. Oh, there's a guy here. Hello there, must protect. How are you, man? Ah, uh, there you go. What are we protecting? Give him a bow. Give him the wizard bow. Give him this. A little of the frostbite goes a long way. I wonder if I can straight backstab a claymore. Reminiscent of the DS3 days. Ah, uh, I don't think so. Although that was a rolling attack, not so much anything else. Ah, the rolling attack you can't strafe. Okay. Oh, wow, that does chip damage pretty well, man. I think it's because he's frostbitten. Oh, that time he did that. Damn. Fun fight, must protect. I appreciate a great sword user, because I love great swords myself. I'm using the ice ring hatchet. Oh, you mean the stupid uh, curse build up one? Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Little Aggie just hit a run. Wait, did I miss something? I, I haven't tried any sleep at all. Sleep hasn't been something that I've utilized. It, there's arrows, but I haven't seen anything else. Why no Moon Veil? I, I, I don't know. This, everyone's using Moon Veil. I feel like... Uh, I don't know. Moon Veil's just not as interesting as the Frost Stomp, to be honest. I somehow attained a classic chase style from Elden Ring. I know, it's actually nice. The fashion here is great. There's so much armor I haven't like gotten yet though. I have to go grab the rest of it. Um I'm trying to think of like cool boss armor since we can transpose later for a different build. Yeah, there's so many moon veils, to be honest. Too many moon veils. I'm trying to keep it a little bit different. Alright, we'll go for one more invasion here, just so I can get some food we've been doing this for oh for like yeah hey okay. um get that out of the way maybe the belfries you think there's good fights there we did all the atlas plateau and route okay we could try one more at the manor moon rails played out it's not for the cool kids anymore exactly man exactly <laughs> all right I'll go for the last one here.
Uh, yeah, so I have a character that's at meta at 130. Well, 130 to 150 is what everybody's saying meta is going to be, but there's not enough invasions there right now. So I'm just doing 60 to 80 until more people get there. So I can get active invasions. Next stream, we'll do 80. And then after that, 100, see if it's active, and then make our way up to what we think is going to be around like meta level. But we'll see how the activity is, I guess. Backstab build. I wish. I mean, we've been landing some decent backstabs, but they don't work as well as they did in Dark Souls 3, that's for sure. Oh my god, the sex bots, though. Oh wait, I'm running the wrong way. Well, I guess we'll see what everyone decides upon. Oh, Himura. Okay. Wait. Oh, holy, hello, Himura. Double axes, that's pretty sick. Gotta give them that. That'll probably do some hefty damage. Gotta watch out. Oh, wow, hand. That was unfortunate by the hand. <laughs> the tree broke. That's funny. Our ones for days. Cha. Wow, that was unfortunate for this poor guy. He's a very tanky phantom though. What does that do? Are those homing soul masses? That's pretty cool. Give that to them. Jump attack. That is actually pretty sick. Aw, oh, we missed. <laughs> The absolute best aim on katanas you've ever seen by me in this sun, bro. All the bleed of those die behind me. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> so those hands, dude. Those hands are so strong, actually. Oh my god, alright, I'll call it there, that was fun. That was a good session. Minus steam maintenance happening, so... Uh, here's the character at the end, if you guys want to try it out. Level 60's been really active for me. Uh, we're gonna try Kaelid 70 or 80 tomorrow, see how active that is. Let's go see if we can give someone a raid. Who else is playing the Elden Ring? Um... Is anyone doing PvP in Elden Ring? That's the question. Not really. Maybe St. Riot is he doing? Let's see. <laughs> uh, well, if you guys want uh, a friend of the channel, St. Riot, super chill dude. Played some uh, games with him in the past. Mostly Among Us. <laughs> it was a fun time though. He's chill. Go tell him we say hello. If you guys want to watch, continue watching Elden Ring. I will be back. Next stream, I don't know what kind of build, probably do wield of some kind around level 80-ish for Kaelid, I suppose. Try invading that area. Yeah, we'll see you guys. You have a good night. Goodbye. Get some food. Enjoy your night.